Hey everybody, today on the show, this is the Lime Popsicle, and today on the show, we have Pants, the Pants Popsicle, and today on the show, we're going to play Family Feud, wow, we feud all the time, have you ever seen this uh, show, no, never, so back in the day when this show Start. That was a lie. I've seen it numerous times. Oh, well, I, I bet you don't know about Richard Dawson, do you? Um, I don't know. But he was the first host of the show. He was a very popular host of Family Feud for many years. And one of the things he was famous for doing was kissing all of the female guests on the show. Is he that... Wasn't, didn't he also do uh, that game where he had the long microphone? Was Did he do it? He was a guy who was like, he had really short gray hair. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, I think I know that guy. Well, actually, he was probably brown. He probably just got gray later. But I, I don't know if you folks know, but he was an actor before he was a game show host. He was a, he was on Hogan's Heroes. He was one of the stars of that show. The I, think I've, uh, I think I've seen the guy that you're talking about. You have? Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. So, What's that name of that guy that's there now? Uh, Charlie something? Um, is it Charlie? Uh, who is he? Uh, the viewers will tell us. Let's go. Uh, I, is it that dude? Yeah, definitely. Oh, yeah. Wasn't there another guy that hosted too? That, Ray Combs? Didn't he? Ray Combs host it? I don't know who that is. I think Ray Combs did it after Richard there Dawson. There was... Uh, the home improvement guy was there for a bit. Tim Allen? No, the other one. I didn't know that. Yeah, but he was I, there. I think Ray Combs did it after uh, Richard Dawson. I'm not sure if viewers could tell us, but you know, my mom really liked him too, but you know what is sad about that is he killed himself. I think he hung himself. He could have just left that out, but okay. Yeah, it's really sad. I don't, I don't mean to bring you down, viewers. It's really sad. But anyway, I don't know who did it after that. It, maybe it was your Tim Allen guy or whoever. Um, it's really bo bothering me that I don't know the name of the guy who's there now. Before He's we start, though, an I want interesting guy. Yeah, I want to make a shout out to Jonathan R. Oh yeah. Because Jonathan R. We haven't mentioned you before. We should though, because I mean, you've been you've been pulling for us for a long time. <laughs> you've been you. I love how you participate. You know, when I say you know, write a comment about this in the video, and you do it like right away and stuff. That's awesome. I, I wish more people did that. You know. So uh, thanks so much for doing that and for being there and like being a big fan. Thanks, Johnny. And of course, thanks Beat Chef as well. You know, because Beat Chef is the old. Yeah, uh, he's he's the, you know well, he's always beating it for us. You know. You know, you kind of uh, accidentally gave a shout out to him numerous times in the uh, Bubble Bobble video. What did I do? Well, I mean, when you were calling me Johnny all the time, you know. Oh, yeah, we can just pretend that you're yeah. referring to him. Not Beat Chef, you mean Jonathan, yeah. Yeah. And uh, anybody else you want to make a, a shout-out to? They're all good. Yeah, there's that one guy, Moko, Mako Wakoko, or something like that. <laughs> I don't know, he's probably not going to know I'm talking about him, because I can't remember his name. <laughs> but his name is like Mo Mota Waki Tikoko, or something. Dude, if you know, well, know if you're that guy and you know and you know I'm talking about you, if you can decipher what I'm saying, then thanks also. I really appreciate you as a fan. Hey, I'll tell you who you are, so you'll know. You're the guy that did the. You remember, you did the duet with me on "You've Lost That Love and Feeling." Like you mixed our voices together and you you put it together. That was awesome. I loved that when you did that. That was great. That's who I'm talking about. Is you that guy? I can't, I always forget your name. You know, <laughs> I can't pronounce it right or whatever i don't know but anyway shout out to you as well and a shout out to everyone else we don't want to leave anyone else out because we don't think oh i don't want people to watch the video and say oh oh this video is for those three people well i'm leaving you know because it's not like that not like that it's just these people who support us for a long time but we love all of you all you people that support us we really do and so that's why i wanted to say and and that girl that said recently that she said she loves us or something, and then she disappeared or comment disappeared. Well, you were great, man, a girl. Uh, <laughs> but I don't know where you went, but you were you were great, and hopefully you're still out there somewhere. Okay, you ready, pants? I'm ready. 
We should play the game. Family Feud! <laughs> TM. How many families do we have? I think we have, well, I've got one and you've got one, so it'd be two families. Oh. You see how it works? Is it addition? Guess what, everybody? That doesn't look like Richard Dawson. I have a lovely wife and two sons named Frank. Do you? Am I supposed to type something here now, probably? If anybody knows what that was a reference to, I'd be surprised. But, you know, Beat Chef, you might know. Or someone else might know. I'm not just Beat Chef. So, if anybody does know, I'm going to be extremely surprised. So, I'm going to say that again. I say, like, it's something like, yes, I have a, a lovely wife and two sons named Frank. So, this is some really pretty text. I like it. You're, 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 you're turned on by that, Pants? I don't know if I'd say that I'm aroused, but... Uh, no, no. I don't mean... Turned on doesn't have to mean that. I mean, I guess it usually does. Oh, I'm but, sorry. But there was a children's show, actually. The viewers, do you know this, viewers? There's a children's show in 1979 called Whatever Turns You On. And, it, of course, it didn't mean that, like the way Pants is saying. Right? The, the on switch... I don't know. It was a sister show to You Can't Do That on Television, which I know that at least, I know that the, hey, uh, one put your I name in, man. I know Thin Fry Tofo knows about that show. Okay. We're waiting for you here. Okay, so this is, this is, uh, me. So everybody. Speaking of, uh, Thin, tied, thin Fried Tofu, you'll realize that, uh, you have a very noisy keyboard and mine is silent. Do you have to tell him that, man? Why not? Because he doesn't know it's me. Come on. Well, I don't want him to think it's me. I can't believe you just threw me under the bus, man. I can't believe it. Don't worry, I'll scrape you off the pavement. Can you believe that guy? Can you believe that viewers what he just did? He's trying to get me in trouble. I can't believe he did it. I love oh. my, uh, I love my, uh, keyboard. <laughs> yeah. I have a, well... You know, I do have a gamepad, viewers, in case you're wondering why I don't use the gamepad. Because you say, why do you use it? Because it's not noisy. Well, it doesn't work. It really, it doesn't work. It is yeah. new. And it doesn't work. Like, even Pants knows, and he's a computer expert. He knows You should read. Work. Name an article someone might wear even at a nudist colony. Okay, so we have to ring in. So I just rang in. Yeah. Uh, an article. What a weird question. Clothing. <laughs> It's kind of surprising, actually. I wonder if, uh, I think, uh, that's a good answer. Is hat? Yes! Hat is on the board, viewers. I can do better than that. Give me a break. It's line time. Uh. Go for it, pants. All right. That was a great answer, though. I think it should be higher than... Oh! You got man. one higher than me. Yeah, I'm playing, man. That's why you get to go again, I guess. I wish that I had, like, a team of uh, people, like, you know, in real life, when you don't have to do all of them yourself. Yeah. Um, we love all you viewers, don't forget. Let's try this. <laughs> yeah. This is probably true if your eyes don't work, right? Oh, yeah. That's a good answer. you got to be able to see the nude. Oh! Oh! It's, like, uh, it's critical. You got first answer, Pants. Yeah. You're so winning happy. the game. I'm kind of all out of ideas now. <laughs> um, what the hell? Yeah, that's not Richard Dawson, that guy. He's just uh, he's a Nintendo game show host, this guy. Does this count as clothing? Oh, I wouldn't call it as, as a, but it's an article. Maybe it's... You gotta know what time it is. Oh, you did it, Pants, Pants. You are getting everywhere. So glad. Actually, this, viewers, do you think this, this category is a little easy, though? Because, I mean, there aren't many things that you would wear at a nudist column, you know? Yeah, well, that's... Uh, kind of narrows it down. That's the point. It was an even playing field, though, wasn't it? Yeah, he's right, he's right, viewers. <laughs> well, I'm not gonna get this one, so... I'll just wait for the time to go down. Why is your name Zoof? I don't know. I can... I don't know. That's what I do, you know? 
Oh, I thought that was Fantastic Four over there, but it's Family Feud. Those Fs. <laughs> Yeah, it's not Fantastic Four. Um, Viewers, do you can, can you think of any articles of clothing? Jonathan, write some in the blanks. Maybe you wear a... Uh, Everybody can write some in the blanks, not just Jonathan. A, uh, a strike against you, pants. Tassels of some sort? Oh, now... Oh. Can I answer that? Are you still going? Yeah, I get three strikes, remember? All right! I, I that's, wonder that's if... That's not uh, how you spell tassels, is it? How do you spell it? I thought you spelled it E E L. I thought so. Yeah, you might be. Right. I mean, you might be right. I, I'm thinking of a group. There was a uh, a singing group called the Tassels, and they spelled it E L. So I just. No, I, I think you're right. I don't think that would be a good answer. Well, anyway. That's a really bad answer, though. Well, they sometimes have ridiculous answers. You're talking about you like never... burlesque artists. You think? Have you burlesque? never seen? Have you never seen the show? It was a dumb answer. Right? Yeah, I was, but have but, you seen but, the show? But viewers, viewers, he's thinking like a burlesque. Artists, you know, that swing their tassels around and stuff. I think we're which, completely aware of that. I, I well, don't know if we could talk about that, but... The older <laughs> ones. You just did. Yeah, but that's what he's, that's what he's talking oh, about. Oh, man. Uh, okay. I, I, I should have an answer here. Uh, hats. Uh, I did that. I know. Crap. Frick. I give up. No okay. slugs. I don't want to... I don't want to waste time. Oh, I can't just end. They won't let me pick nothing. No, you you can't forfeit. You, you gotta pick try. You gotta try. I forfeit. Look look what look at this. Now no, I'm gonna have to do this, right? Yeah, good luck. And, and I I'll try to distract you the same way you distracted me. Thanks, Lime family's gotta do it. Look my look my family. Yeah, you guys look like nerds. They're weird looking. <laughs> uh, okay, name your someone. They look like they're something. from the eighties. That's for sure. Okay, I got it. One of your favorite articles of clothing. Uh, I hope that doesn't... That's not a separate answer from shoes. It might be. Oh, yeah, I can't man. believe it, viewers. Socks should be good, right? You what do you just... think two would be? I don't think... Nudist colonies, the thing about them is they're like beaches usually, right? You don't wear socks on the beach. Ring? I was gonna... I just thought of that. I just thought of rings. That's all... That was... <sighs> I just thought of that, but I didn't think it would be on there. That's definitely not an article of clothing. But our what others, a, well, out of 100 people surveyed, the top seven answers are on the board. Nice reading. Name something you are sure to turn off before you leave the house for the day. See, I have to read it first, and it gives them time to... No, I'm not going to make you. What are you talking about? about? I'm sorry. How, how could I understand it? Like, you can't read it and process at the same time? Yeah, but I wanted to finish before I pressed the button. I'm going to finish reading. Okay, well... That's okay, don't worry. I'll, I'll just what should to... I do, wait next time? No, I'll, I'll just do it differently. I don't think this is a great answer either. It's probably on there, but it's... No, I'll yeah. just read it after we buzz in. That's what I'll do. Okay, that's fine, I guess. Oh, is it my turn? Oh, then you're going to have to Somebody just start turn off before you leave the house for a day. Did you, you said lights? I don't know how to read. Yeah, that's right. Hey, it's not working. What do you mean it's not working? I was Press pressing the, right the buttons, button. but... Why the did right you... Buttons. The oven, I guess. I want to change my answer, but I don't have time. No, you, it's probably better than... There's probably more than three people that answer. Oh, that. look, it's number one! Stove, yeah, that's a better answer than oven. Yours, yeah, I almost counts. changed it. Blinds play, yes. Well, you can put in your other answer now. Uh, what is it? It's nice how they gave it to me. You know, they give the answers to you like they realize what they are. Yeah, that is good. I'm surprised, actually. Oh, TV. That's a good answer for sure. Yes, what? television. How is that only worth three? It was low, but I got it. Look at me going around. Did you see my woman? Woo, 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 she was going. Yeah, I think I'm going to steal this one for you, by the way. Looks like cat of it, doesn't it? There's no way you're going to clean the board. I'm Doesn't that like cat, my, my wife? Which one? The one with the weird the glasses? Right there. I don't know. Yeah, I got to think. You're... Yeah, no kidding. What would cat turn off before she left the house? Um, I don't know. Dog. <laughs> 
turn off the door? <laughs> it doesn't make sense, but I don't know what to say. Oh, let's not... turn that door off. Um, I forgot to do that one. It's almost burned the house down. Turn off something. What do you turn off before you leave a house? What do you turn off? Try coat hanger. <laughs> <laughs> Jeez, I don't know. Uh, I'm stealing this from you big time. Radio, I guess. I don't know. That's a good answer. I gotta remember what my answers were. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I got it. Uh, I was gonna say the tap, you know, but why would you have it on in the first place? Why not? Why? I was thinking, well, yeah. Like, I feel like in the morning is somewhat implicit in this question, right? You turn off in the morning? No, you're leaving, in, so it's something that you had on in the morning. Like, assuming you're going to work type thing, doesn't matter. I, I don't know. I, don't, I have no idea. Yeah, pick tap. I have no clue. Oh, viewers, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, this wasn't line time. I'm They'll sorry. forgive you. I have two answers in my head, and one of them is very similar to tap. It's zoof time. Which is shower. See, I'm going with this morning theme. Oh. But I'm going to go with also... But why would you have the shower on, though? Because you took a shower. Yeah, but you turn up before you leave the house. <laughs> That's yes. I mean, long before you leave the house. Don't you also do the same with the stove? You cook your food or whatever, then you turn it off. Maybe. Maybe not, though. I don't know what else you would have on. The TV seems like a great answer, like seconds before. Yeah. Oh, I can't believe it! Viewers, how did he do that? So good. I think he's looking at the answers. <laughs> iron. Heater? Yeah. Iron. <laughs> Curling iron? Two irons. That's, uh... Iron is pretty, uh... I guess in the 80s, maybe that made sense. I guess people, people some iron people. food? Well, I guess you... <laughs> <laughs> I guess you gotta iron your suits, right? You know, it only happens at job. every wedding. I forgot that we were doing stuff. A marriage. Yeah, I was thinking that. <laughs> That's not actually true. Not every wedding does have a marriage. Vows. Not bad. The game's broken, apparently. Well, it took a long time. <laughs> wow. really How are there not vows? What the hell? I mean, I don't eh, know. Eh. okay. What else do you do at a wedding? <sighs> Every wedding. I the thing is, I don't want to play, but I guess I'll I'll just put this in. You oh, oh, oh this one anyway. That's right. Man, don't worry. I'm gonna, this. I'm gonna pass it to you. I suck at this. Oh, oh, wow. No dancing. You don't dance wedding. either, pants. Okay. Uh, is this your turn now? Yeah. All right. Kiss. Don't tell me. Why not? I want you to have it. No, that's not fair. No, because I want to steal it from you. It's tactical. You need something that happens at every wedding. Uh, you tell me a kiss doesn't happen? Okay. Uh, I mean, I guess okay, you don't I got, need to kiss the bride. Uh, wait, I got to put it in. Okay. Uh, how do you spell? Okay. Uh, I don't have time. Yeah, I was wondering if there's a special word for that. You can do it if you're real quick. Yep, yep, there you go. Yay! Toss flowers. I no. did it, viewers! I got an answer! I got an answer! I'm forfeiting this. Toss flowers! Don't right. throw the game. I, you can. I'm not throwing the game. This is tactical. Oh, he's 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 too sneaky, isn't he, viewers? Okay. Uh, you're allowed to pass. I'm gonna throw it to you because you're sneaky. Oh, okay. Yeah. I'm okay with it. You you didn't try to fake me out to do that. I hope. <laughs> no. Okay. Um. Because I got so many either. I got some answers. Oh, you do now, eh? 
I've always had answers. Yeah. Well, that's because you, you got a beard and blonde hair. I don't have a beard. Yeah, you do. Didn't you see? I'd like one. Oh, you meant in the game. Yeah. Dude, look at he's got he's got like a black beard and brown hair. So did they like do hair. completely different things at weddings in the eighties or like what's happening here? Well what did you just say? Toast. You eat toast? No, I know <laughs> what you mean. I'm just kidding. Um, eat toast, yeah. Jesus. Uh oh, I did have the kiss thing, didn't I? Let's go with kiss. I think you gotta do that. Yeah. Jesus Christ. Okay, I'm going to just put... I'm going to just assume that the game can just figure out what this means. I don't want to type a whole sentence. <laughs> okay. Wow. These weddings I'll, are a different culture. I wonder if you... I, I mean, maybe you need to type the whole thing. I don't know how this game works. But if throw bouquet and tower, yeah. Let me pots. let me try it. Let me try it. Kiss the bride. I was gonna say cat. <laughs> Kiss the cat. Yeah. I think that's some weird wedding. <laughs> wedding between two cats. Yeah. Wow. It's fine time, viewers. Okay. That's annoying. It's a lime time. <laughs> Crying. Sure. Throw rice. Oh, yeah. I guess Cut so. the cake. Save. I said vows. Yeah, but you didn't say say. See? Give rings. This game is weird. I wonder why, um, cut the cake, why there was no space between cut and the. We're girls now. Okay, here we are. Little girls. Get ready. Eat oh, it. you beat me. Eat it. You beat me. There's no way I read faster than you, so I must have just... Because I can't read. I must have just uh, thought faster. <laughs> read the question. Name something you put on a pizza. Everyone knows you put this on a pizza. Wow. Apparently this is something easy. Is... You can do better than that? I'm hungry. Hey, say, let's eat some pizza. I did eat pizza today, actually. And there was pepperoni on it. That is a great answer. Somewhat out of the box. I win! Good job. Viewers, I won! I won! <laughs> now yes. what? Okay, so what do I put on a pizza? <laughs> Cats. Mush. Wrong country. I wonder if they do that anywhere. You're not pressing the button. Oh, the frick! There you go. Thanks <laughs> you for find... telling me. Yeah, you're welcome. <laughs> mushrooms. What kind of mushrooms? Mmm. Good ones. Shiitake? Mushrooms. Come on, mushrooms. Yes! Viewers, lime is sweeping it. Okay. <laughs> what, what do you also put on pizza? Uh, oh, I like meat, but I don't know if they do. Uh, do Maybe people put, put tomatoes? They put tomatoes on pizzas, I think. Limes. I don't think anyone's ever put a tomato on a pizza. <laughs> Are you serious? I mean, not, not a tomato itself. No, I mean bits of them. Maybe. I don't... I Go ahead. Tomatoes. Yes! Viewers, he tried to talk me out of it. Okay, what else do I put on pizza? Uh, let's see. Does that count as the sauce? Pizza. Pizza, yeah. You gotta put pizza uh, on it. Pineapple. Uh, yeah, if you're a weird person. I love pineapple. <laughs> do you think pepperoni isn't meat? Mm. Come on. They're trying well, to ruin it. How am I ruining it? <laughs> you gotta answer it anyway. Oh, okay. Yeah, kind of had that covered, but... Uh, I think you need to be more specific bacon. or something else. Bacon. Okay. Bacon bits on pizza. That's great, dude. Name all the meats, man. Oh. 
This is tough. I don't know if I'm going to be able to do this. Why don't I go for my favorite? Pine yeah, I think I got it, though. Well, you can, but the problem is it's not going to be there. Why? It might be. I don't know. What? I'll I could be wrong. Apples. I could be wrong, man. Hawaiian pizza. Pineapple. Oh! Viewers, can Pants pull his pants up and get the last answer? Now, see, again, I don't know how specific I need to wow, be, so this way is going to really pants. F with me. Well, if I don't steal this, you have 178 points, you realize. I didn't realize that. Okay. Well, I mean, that's what that number at the top means. <laughs> yes. Green. You put green on pizzas. And then I almost accidentally clicked end, which would have been devastated. Green. He puts green on pizza. The thing is, I don't think... I, I don't know if green is important. I mean, just peppers in general. I was going to say peppers, but I thought that was the same as pepperoni. What? I was going to say peppers, but I thought it was pepperoni. Uh, the audience is going to be baffled by what you just said. Oh. I wonder what it is. Yeah, well, I'm one. That's me. That's you. What's the answer? Time. Sausage. That's that's meat. It was not meat. Oh, I missed the meat. That's the meat I meant, too. That's the meat I meant. <laughs> Quote of the LP. I thought that green peppers and pepperoni were the same. I, I did. That's why I didn't put it in. <laughs> How many hours a day do babies sleep? Crap, I didn't want to answer this. This is so dumb. How many do they eat a day? This has got to be the worst Family Feud question ever, I which I'll I didn't explain answer that. afterwards. It's too late. you got to pick one. Babies sleep a lot, you know. Um, this is by far the stupidest Family Feud question in the history well, of time. how's that? That's a great answer. I'm not even kidding. I won! I won! I can't believe it! Do you want to play? Uh, pass. Yeah, because I just have to guess numbers. I know, that's why it's so dumb. You just and there's like seven or ten on the board or something. You just pick every number below. I know. 12. How about ten? Let's see if ten works. Like which idiot came up with this? I win. This is fun. It's gonna be almost impossible not to get them all. I wonder if I can I wonder I'm gonna try eleven. That sounds like a good number. <laughs> I would try all of them below twelve. Wow. Oh, no, 11. Oh. People have an aversion to 11, apparently. What did, did I say, 10 already? Yeah. Yeah. 9. I bet 9. I bet that one, right? Yeah. I just figured out I'm going to win this category. Oh, oh my goodness. God. Jesus. What is happening? Uh, <laughs> you better start going higher. Be <laughs> yeah. Oh! What? Oh, viewers, viewers! What is happening? Pants is going to steal! Okay, I thought that you were going to go... I don't know how this game works exactly, but... I mean, I figured you were going to do all of them, and there's going to be a trick answer, which was zero. <laughs> but now, I certainly don't think that's true. I guess it's only even numbers, sorry. You can't do odd numbers. Right? Because you tried 11 and 12B. Oh, and 9. I didn't I clue into that. Why do people hate odd numbers? I, 14 might not be right, but should I go 8? Babies don't... They, they don't, sleep for a long time, usually, I think. They don't want to do odd numbers, baby. Yeah, we better go with 14. Oh! And he's, he's, he's caught on to it, viewers. Apparently, babies only sleep for even numbers. <laughs> They're like... Uh, 18, 16... Camels. Oh, there's oh. an odd number. 15, 20, 6, 4, 8, 3. That's so bizarre. You just somehow, like, picked all the numbers that it didn't like. Years, that was harder. Hey, I'm ahead, years. It's line time. Round. How many rounds are there? I thought there were... I don't know how this 15. game works. What? Creamed vegetable? <laughs> <laughs> when I read that, I was like, name a cream pie. Wait, uh, okay, cream vegetable. Years, if you know what he's referring to, and I know some of you will. I think I can do this. Maybe. Beats and Johnny's will know. I don't like food categories. Me. I don't know. 
I don't know anything about But pizza. I like pizzas. I need a I need to hire a personal chef for the rest of my life. I guess there's no creamed mushrooms. I was kinda of thinking of like creamed mushroom soup, you know, isn't that a thing? Yeah, yeah. Alright, good. Glad to know I'm Is not creamy. Cheese creamed. a vegetable? <laughs> was that serious? Yeah. Are you doing wow, you're you know way less about food than I do. Is okay? apple a vegetable? I didn't even know that was possible. It's a fruit, isn't it? Name a creamed vegetable. What do you think a creamed apple would be? <laughs> Celery. Excuse me, sir. Can you cream this apple for me, please? How do you cream something? I don't even know. <laughs> creamed celery. I love it. <laughs> I don't know. This Why do like you cream apple something? Juice. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I don't know how you cream something. <laughs> Uh, with moisturizer, maybe? I don't know. <laughs> it's your turn. I was going to say a banana. Can you cream a banana? <sighs> okay, I had an answer in my head. I, I got him now. Uh, what did you say? Yeah, cream broccoli, for sure. <laughs> I didn't say that. <laughs> what did you say, then? Mushrooms, yeah, exactly. Cream potatoes? Is there an E on potato? Hell no. Cream potatoes. That's only if a potato has toes. I'm going to run out of time here. Like a human. Did I spell potato correctly? Oh, you won. Yeah, I know about cream potato, like scallop potatoes. Yeah, I eat potatoes. cream potatoes. I eat them. <laughs> yeah. I forgot, are they called that though? Maybe. Sometimes. Is it my turn again? Yeah. Oh, broccoli. Creamed broccoli. Maybe. <laughs> Broccoli. Come on, broccoli. Oh, darn it. Hmm. What about radio? Is it radio's vegetables? Radios? Yeah. No. <laughs> okay. Uh, this is going to be really bizarre. I'm just going to have to name, like, every vegetable in the world. Cream apricots, maybe. Um, How about kumquats? Remember we discussed kumquats in our, our Plant Pants and Line Possible Discuss Food video? Remember Creamed that? beans. I don't know if anyone's ever seen that video before. Yeah, some people. Viewers, if you go back to our very first video on this channel, we discussed food. That's true. In a podcast, and we talk about kumquats. So if you want to hear about that, just go and listen to that. That's not how you spell beets, man. Hey, Beat Chef could tell you. That's not how you spell it. You're spelling Beat Chef. That's what you're doing. Yeah, that's true. Creamed beets. Mm, no beets. Yeah, that was an homage. Okay. Uh, hey, Beet Chef, do you want to hear my British impression since you're British? He probably does. It, it goes like this. Don't blow me. How you doing today, mate? <laughs> it's good to see you. Oh, it's foggy today, ain't it? Ew. How, how is that good, Beet Chef? Did you say mate at any point in time? Yeah, I guess I was Australian. Yeah, you kind of got them mixed up there. Yeah, but but I was thinking, like, I kind of, like, when I do British people, I know they almost sound like that. It, it's like, I'm like the Oliver Twist type guys, you know? You know what the good thing is about this is, no matter what I put, it doesn't really matter, because, I mean, there's no way you're going to be able to come up with a vegetable that you create. Or a beet chef, I could do it like this, I could do, would you like a spot of tea, perhaps? I wonder if this is offensive or not. Is this is this the Queen of England today? You know, like that. Like that's another British accent I can do. Beans. I don't know if the S is important. Creamed beans. Gotta love them. So that was like the British popsicle. <sighs> wow. So, can you come up with a creamed vegetable? <laughs> I know it's. <laughs> I know not everybody sounds like that, but I was trying to think stuff. So what did you say? I didn't look at any of them. I don't know. Weird things. Creamed. Oh, I got one. Corn. Damn it. You got it. I went you... the whole thing? Yes. Yeah. That was it. It's line time. It's line time, viewers. 
<laughs> I'm surprised you didn't ask if corn was a thing first. Green peas, green carrots, green spinach, all oh, cream. Oh, I didn't know the onions though. Yeah, that was all a little bit more obvious after. Oh Man, wow, you disappeared. Stupid. They kicked me off the you game. You went home or something? Did you win? Yeah. Ah, oh, butthole bank. I, should I play fast money? Answer five questions. And how? How come you don't play? Name the age when a man is over the hill. That's not. I'll help you. Out. That's not true. Oh, just pick one. Sixty-five. That's too old. It's, it's not even true. Uh hmm. Don't look at my answers. Name a junk food. Oh, okay. Um. This is you. Um, chips. I don't want to put potato chips in because it takes. You gotta time. hurry, by the way. You gotta I know, I know. I'm not going fast enough. Uh, name the month you do your spring cleaning. Uh, 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 Springtime. May. It's not bad. May. Mauve. No, not mauve. No, it's not mauve. Ma May. Where's May? <laughs> name the animal you would like to be reincarnated as. Cat. You're not supposed to working? actually... Where's the letters? What are you doing? Oh, it is... CAC? It is working. Why are you spelling CAC? I didn't see the words, the letters coming up. My I God. think it was working. Name the state where you'd first like, least like to live. Jesus, Alaska. Uh, Alaska. I don't know. Vermont sucks, I hear. <laughs> you should have picked Alaska, man. Because they got a lot of child rapists in Vermont, I've heard. Okay. Jesus. <laughs> That's right. 65 win! Chips! No, I didn't win that one. May won Cat. Vermont, I was wrong. Alright, pick Alaska next time. <laughs> Answer five questions in the time given. Name the age when a man is over the hill. Pick like 50 this time. No. Yes, it's the right answer. Just pick 55. it. 55. I'm not I, doing what you say. Okay. Name no a junk food. Ice uh, cream. Ice cream. Candy. It's not going to be there. I don't know why you don't want my help. Cause you realize I'm out of the game, right? Yeah. You've already won. I'm, I'm going to do it myself. Name the... No mommies! Name okay, the month you do your spring cleaning. At least pick Alaska this time. Because that's going to be the answer. Name the animal you like to be reincarnated as. Not a dog. Uh, I don't... What animal, dude? I don't know. Uh, Definitely dog. Pick dog. You're not supposed to answer this person. I bet people want to... Oh, he's right. I forgot. I bet people might say a bird. I bet people like to fly. I bet you. I think dog would have been a great answer. Name the dogs. Okay, I almost swore. Okay, at least pick this Alaska case, this time. Where you at least like to live. Yeah, think about it. Personal. It's... I keep forgetting that personal. Alaska. It has fine. to be the answer. Alaska, fine. I don't think there's anything wrong with it, but I bet people have an aversion to it. It's going to be a great answer. What I meant is they, they let, you know, they let, like, never mind, I'm not even going to go there. <laughs> Candy's there. Wow. Bird. April. Alaska. You should have went with 50. Is it going to tell us the top answers? <clears throat> I hope so. <laughs> <laughs> when does it when does I win you have won this round of family feud all the money you have won from the fast money goes into an account which when it totals $20,000 will be awarded to your family hmm. what <laughs> you have to I don't play know. Oh, okay feud against new family try for the $20,000 <clears> start a new Feud against a new family. Start a new feud. Which it's just saying you want to continue with your thing. Yeah, let's do it. I'm gonna. I'm gonna challenge. Do you get to play again? Yeah. Are you sure it's you? Yeah, it's me. Because I don't want to play. It's not you. Oh, it's me. I'm challenging. I wanted to see the top answers because I know that. Uh, um, for I sure. Just, I just have to. I have to clarify something. I said there's a lot of child rapists in Vermont, okay? But what oh, yeah. I meant to say was that I, they, they give lenient sentences to them. So they let them out of, like, jail fast. The judge is there. So it's not like 
it's the judges, it's not the, the state, you know. So I wasn't saying that there are more people there that do it. It's just that the judges don't properly prosecute them over there. They're too lenient towards them. So. Let's go with And I only know this because I see it on the news all the time, viewers. It's not because, you know, I just see it on the news all the time. And I'm like... Marcus family. Yeah, and other things. They, they have other laws there. It's not just that. They have other laws I don't really agree with in Vermont. I'm not going to go into it, but... You know, so I, that's why I said Vermont. So, anyway, but let's not get into political stuff. Let's yeah, just no kidding. stick to the game viewers. You should have picked 50, too, for over the hill. Barkus. Or maybe what? 40. Where do you get these names from? I just make them up as I type. Okay. Okay, here we go. I can do this, I think. I hope. Can you? I'm not telling. The Scandinavia account? Do you Al think we have any... Did a, you know, Al Jolson did a song called Scandinavia. Do we have any Swedish viewers? It's not very well known, though. It's pretty... Uh, I guess I won that one. It's a pretty obscure song. Yeah, I'll play. From the early 20s. I'm probably going to make some answers that are a little bit stupid, but... You know, what can you do? Love it. Right? That was so rude. <laughs> So what else is, like, in that spot? Do you know? <laughs> um, it's Scandinavia. Oh, look, you're jumping up and down. That, Russia? That young girl in your family is jumping up and down. Yeah, she's happy. Hey, look at I, you. Hey, look at you. You look like a clown on the side there. The, yeah, that's that's Sideshow Bob or something. And then and then the guy on the other end looks like he looks like he's like dazed and confused or something. I wish I knew about Scandinavian countries. I bet you there's like a Scandinavian viewer. And that one laughing. girl that looks like he's like a rock and roller or something. You know, the one the white. And the yes. yeah, I mean that color is yellow, not white. Check. And then it's like the grandmother there. Czech Republic? Is it what your is that turn? Called? Oh. <laughs> Czechoslovakia? I can't spell that. Spell it. I can spell Slovakia. By the way, I want to do a show to all our Slovakian viewers because uh, you know I think Slovakia is a pretty cool country. Like I did, I didn't know about it till recently, but oh no, I, I know. I think like I think you're kind of cool there, you know. I'm gonna run out of time. You Slovaks. Oh, I got it. Damn it. You put Sovaka. Did I? It's like Neil Sadaka, but... Slovaka. No, I put an E in there, or an I in there. <clears throat> My turn? Is that what you mean? There was no I? Is that what you're saying? Uh, Hello? I don't think you finished it. Yeah, I put I-A. Oi! Damn it. I wish I knew some Slovakian countries. Germany? <laughs> I don't uh -oh. think so, right? I don't think so. Maybe, I, I don't know. Oh my god, Ireland? I'm not good at this either, I don't, I don't know. Ireland, no way, are you kidding me? No, I'm kidding. I don't, I'm don't. i just trying to think of northern Isles. European countries and I can't do it. Or the United Kingdom. I don't know if that has anything to do with anything. Yeah, you said Ireland. Yeah, I know that. Only Northern Ireland is part of the United Kingdom, by the way. The rest of Yeah, I know, I know. You're right, You know, he's right, viewers. Do you know any Slovakian countries? No. I only knew... Oh, wait, Scandinavian, I mean. Uh, I only knew uh, two, apparently. So you said Sweden. Sweden and Norway. Oh, I think I just came up with one. Sweden, Norway. Okay, I'm going to guess. It's a decent guess, I think. It's in my mind that doesn't know anything. Denmark. Yes! Oh, good work. Lime time, viewers! It's lime time! Switzerland? Finland. Finland. That's an obvious one. Yeah, I should have gotten that. <laughs> I was trying to think of which teams compete in the Olympics in hockey, because that's the answer. <laughs> Alright, here we go. How many nights a week do you stay up for the Tonight Show? This is a number, another stupid number question. Or, yeah, number question. There's only like five nights it's on, so... Yeah, there's not many options here. Three. How could, there's six answers, but it's only on five nights. 
I have a theory. Oh, I get it. How come you get to go? Oh, I, I, yeah, you didn't I get. Yeah, I get. The highest. Never mind. I got it. Only on Fridays. Oh, damn! Beat you. Yes. I'm gonna win. Every How does the scoring go? Is it first to 200 wins? I think that's what it is. I'm gonna win. It's like unlimited rounds. Wait, do you see how I get this category? <laughs> Are you gonna guess all the numbers below five? <clears throat> and five. Okay, good call. <clears throat> guess what I'm gonna guess now? How could that be the top answer? I win, viewers! How could the majority of people not watch The Tonight Show? That doesn't even make sense to me. <laughs> it's line time. I guess it wasn't the majority, it was the minority. And of course when this game was made, Johnny Carson was still the host of The Tonight Show. Damn it, you're at 186. Yeah, because I guess every night of the week. <laughs> That's so stupid. <laughs> well, I'd like to own but could not afford to keep. Uh... It says the upkeep, by the way. I don't know if that matters. Oh, the upkeep. Oh, okay. I see. Yeah. Uh, I should have told you that. I wish I didn't tell you that. Yeah, thanks. Uh, Pots. A pet. A pencil. Penthouse. Yeah. Is that good? I don't think so. Yeah, I don't know if it is either. I think it's way too specific. Penthouse. Ah, oh, you're right. Could not afford the upkeep. Uh, a wife, maybe? <laughs> Something you would like to own. That's weird. Like, you would like to. Like, <laughs> oh, wow, you're a terrible. Yeah, no. I, I was bad, and then you were worse. I don't think you're understanding what I'm saying. I'm saying, like, I would go with house, but, like, it's impl it says you'd like to own. Don't most people own houses? <laughs> okay, crap. Don't run out of time. I said own a, I own a wife. Did you hear that? It was a funny joke. Yeah, hilarious. I was going to say car. Slave? I was going to say, oh, car, come on. I'll take it. I was going to say car, Bart. I better play this. I was going to say a car. What about, uh, um... Okay, sl viewers, viewers. Slave? Is that okay? <laughs> viewers, yeah. viewers, I know you don't own people. I know. I was just, expensive I was just joking. I was joking, viewers. What would be so expensive that's hard to maintain? Oh, I got one. A I think. spoon. I hope. Poop? Cool. Yeah, poop. That's what I'd, you like. I'd love to own a poop. <laughs> you are. Uh... How come this is so difficult? Damn it. We're silly. Okay, I'm just going to pick house. So, someone said we're silly in a comment recently. I think it was a girl, and she's right. <laughs> okay. So I'd say that. You're silly. Oh, okay. Look at that girl. She's jumping up and down. Yeah. House, that's a good one. You know, wife might be the number one answer. <laughs> <laughs> Um, <laughs> That'd be hilarious if it was. <laughs> oven, stove, Zeus, a horse. Train. A horse. It's a good answer. You know, in Two Broke Girls, they have a horse, but you know, they're in a, they're in an apartment, like, and they couldn't really have a horse in real, like, in a New York apartment, you know. But it's a show, so it's supposed to be funny, you know. Because Whitney Cummings, that was like the only thing she thought of, you know, like. Let's have a horse, she's like, you know. Hmm. But anyway, Cat Dennings is on the show, and that's the only reason I watch it, because it sucks. Okay, anyway. This is really, really difficult. You didn't put horse. I know that. I don't want to use your answers. I want to use yours. Why this is this Barkus? Because I'm the Barkus family. What's a zoof? It sounds like a Nintendo <laughs> game. I wish that... Yeah, there was something like that. Viewers, there is a Nintendo game called... Wasn't it... Wasn't it Zoot? No, it's called Zool. Oh, Zool. Yeah. Okay. I'm going to assume that the game is stupid. And it doesn't know the difference between a pet and a dog. Damn it. <clears throat> Can you get this? Do you have an answer? No. I should have been thinking. <laughs> 
Now you had to talk about two broke girls. Okay, uh, <laughs> I'd like to own but could not afford the upkeep. Uh, I a lamp. Airplane. <laughs> oh! Yeah, I just thought of the exact same thing. A boat? I, I knew as soon as I said airplane, I was like, oh crap, I shouldn't have said that. <laughs> yeah, you reminded me of boats. I won! Oh, you win the game. You did it, Pants! Oh, I You suck. did it! Let's have a horse! A horse! A horse is there! A horse is there. It's a horse, Pants! <laughs> I know. I told you to put a horse! Damn it. You never learned from Poobo Girls. This game sucks. Well, you're out already? <laughs> yeah, it was first at 200 points. Wasn't that fast? Yes. Game and Aaron people run first thing in the morning. Um, Wash your balls. Got it. <laughs> it's a good thing you didn't mention another part, or we would have had a, a censor, if you know what I mean. <laughs> it's an in joke here, viewers. It's a dumb one. What? It's a dumb one. It's a good one. Get. I thought you were gonna put in get nest. What's that? I, I don't know. This is taking uh, a lot of your time up. I know. What's next? Why is it, why does it take know. so long? Hey, a small but dangerous animal. Um, a pig. No, small. <laughs> Assuming it's a small one. I don't think that's Name any dance. What, do you mean like a real dance? Like a Charleston, probably. Is that what they mean? Uh, like that type like of dance? Twist. Yeah, I would say so. I'm just gonna I'm gonna say an actual dance though, like a type of dancing. I don't know if that's what they mean. They might mean what you mean. They definitely Name mean. a place of business where you'd find magazines lying about. Oh I love magazines. I collect you magazines. Accept all of them though. Uh, I collect magazines, viewers. Humor magazines I collect. Humor magazines. From the fifties up to the present. <laughs> you did not sell that right. You name a good place to go on a first date. Park. <laughs> <laughs> I can just imagine how many girls want to go on a first date with you now. Whoa! How is that not? Oh. oh god, you suck. Oh. Oh. Did you actually put daughter? Yeah, I or want... Doctor? I'm... Oh my god, did you get zero on all of them? I lost. Alright, I'll help you this time. Can't... No! Name of Aaron in the morning. Uh, help me. Mail. 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 It's like mail. I don't know. Sorry. It's not going to like it, though, is it? Uh, a rat. No, no. You want, like, sn snake or oh, yeah, spider yeah. or something. Right. Name a dance. Uh, uh, <laughs> the Charles. Yeah, let's, well, the twist. Or a more... Yeah, twist. Something more relevant. What are some other ones? What? More relevant? What are you talking about? Name is relevant. The Charleston is relevant? Of course. I think so. Okay, that should be variety. Dude, story. you don't come from the 20s. Newsstand. Name a good place to go on a first date. Movies. I was going to say that. I, viewers, I was going to say that before you I'm said sorry. it. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I say stole. movies. I was afraid you were going to put another dumb answer like Park. I went to the, I went on a few dates to the park. Yeah, it's a good place to go, but you know. Girls. Mail. Wow, it actually worked. Rat. Rat was better. Twist. Doctor one. And uh, you. Movie. Oh wow. I'm almost up to twenty two thousand. Movies was worth what eighty one. How so... high do I have to go? Twenty thousand. <laughs> Yeah. That's a long way. <laughs> well, you have to win the fast money thing, and then I think you get 20000 Oh. Let's do it again. Viewers, do you want to see us do it really? again? Again? You want to see us do it again, viewers? Tell us. what they say? They said yes. Okay. Uh... You're not allowed to do anything other than what they say. All right. I got to pee really bad. Just pee on the game. No, can I leave for a sec? Yeah, I guess. Maybe so. I should wait till you actually win a category, and then I should go. <laughs> but then you're not going to know what I put in. I don't care. You can tell me. I'm look look at that game. guy. I think that guy in the middle is. 
Oh, I, I never mind. I think he, he might be like, you know, I, I don't want to say. Which guy? The guy in the middle. He looks kind of like, uh, um, what's that badass's name? Um, Chuck Norris. Yeah, yeah. I think there's a football guy over there on the left. Chuck Norris, that's who it is. They look completely different when the camera zooms out. They don't have enough resolution. My there. name's Lime. It looks like they didn't actually even attempt to make them the same. I'm the same family. Dad's feud. All right, Dad. M F let's go. N let's go, fellow Dad. Look at you. You look like a typical Dad too. <laughs> Modern Dad. What? The only thing I know is turtle shit. Yeah. <laughs> I. What new category, like please. Of buzz in? Do we just sit here? <laughs> we might. My guy is. You know who my my dad is? That guy there. That's like the Gomez Adams from the Adams family. Yeah, I guess so. Yeah. See, that is. I look like a. Never mind. Um, Here, so are one of you gonna? You wanna <laughs> like phone in? Cause we don't know. I have no idea. Something that made a tortoise shell. All right, I might as well just guess, right? I. I mean, why not? I was gonna say a turtle. <laughs> a drum. Yeah. Really? Why not? I just, what else can you make out of a turtle shell? Not that. You, you think that was a dumb answer? Oh, I think I know. Natives did it or something. <laughs> a good old turtle drum. <laughs> what is this? Oh. I'm really? guessing when the Mexican runner does this game, he's going to have to keep playing until he gets to 20,000 so he beats the game, right? They actually do ashtray. Am I right? No, I don't think so. Yes, he does, because he's got to beat every game, you know? I don't think he's going to do it that way. I think he's just going to have to win once. I, I can't you. believe he's... you got one. Okay, I better do some thinking here. Uh, Let's try to steal. Oh, well. I'm going to give it to Pants. That was... Do you realize how dumb that was? No. Now you need to get a, think of a second one to somehow win. i got to go to the bathroom. I'll be right back. Okay. What can be made of Eternal Shell? Hmm. Some sort of ball? <laughs> no. A flute? Probably not. A ball. Let's go with ball. I could eat some spaghetti out of a turtle shell. It'd be fun. Well, this game is clearly rigged. Holy cow. Um, how about we make... Hmm, something that a kindergarten child would make out of a turtle shell is a hat. It's probably not true. Davy Crockett, when he ran out of raccoons, tried one of these. So what... What'd you say? <laughs> I picked bowl and hat. Bowl? That sounds good. I know. It's a great answer, isn't it? Yeah. I, I like that one. That's a really good one. Okay, like... Um, you think of another answer? Should make armor out of it. Tortoise shell armor? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's how the Ninja Turtles do it. Hi, Pants. Hello. You want to play the game today? No. <laughs> can you think of two things? Can I? Yeah, you're going to have to think of another one, otherwise I win that category. Are you serious? Yeah, that's how the game works. I won it already. But you passed it to me. I shouldn't have done that. I know, I explained that to you. It's only 18 points anyway. It's not going to amount to anything. Lamp. <laughs> you could be right. I don't know. That's, that's a pretty good answer in my world. I don't think so. That's a great one. 
Oh, I thought it was going to be there. All right, let's see what these are. Imp 1. Why is my back in so much pain? Let's get back to fixing it. Necklaces. The hell? Hairbrush. What? Glasses. Okay. Someone needs to explain hairbrush and glasses to Well, me. the rims of the glasses, not the actual glass. <laughs> <laughs> you brush your hair with the turtle shell? How's that going to work? Maybe the brush you made of it. Oh! A name of uh, people cross. Name a part of the body that people cross, viewers. Mm -hmm. Arms. Yeah, good answer. Yes! That'd be higher than that. Yeah, me too. My turn. I guess I might as well go Oh, I was going to say that. Well, it's obvious. You're going to win. Probably. Well, Feet. Okay. That's not a leg. Sure it is. They gave you that. That's not a leg. Hey, they gave you stovetop. That's not an oven. It's not? No. I thought it was. No, it's not. I mean, they usually come together, but they're not the same thing. Where else do you cross? I got one. Are you ready for this? Well, Pretty creative. Heads? Almost. Hearts. Cross my heart and hope to die. Oh, wow. That's a song. Stick a needle in my eye. Sure, that's more than one song? There's one in the Eurovision Song Contest in the 70s called Cross My Heart. You can go listen to it. And here's another one. Forget who that did it. I told you that I would do that, but I was crossing my fingers. Oh, wow, that's a good one. Because I there's a song called I've Got My Fingers Crossed by Teresa Brewer. That's on my other my music channel, The Lime Pop School. It's a great it's a great song. You should go listen. It's scratchy because the forty five is scratchy, but you should go listen to it. It's good. What else can you cross? And viewers, I just I've never said this, but that channel, the Lime Popsicle, like most of you know this already, like Beach Chef. Oh, uh, dude. But that Lime Popsicle music channel that's also on YouTube, that's my channel as well, where I post old songs and stuff. That's my channel. Stuff. Sweeps it. Yeah. Cross eyes. That's like all the. Never mind. I need to take that as. I feel redeemed, at least. All right, here we go. Name something in which people accidentally bump their heads. I don't know who got that. Wow, that was close. I couldn't really actually think of something, but I just thought I should, you know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, tall people for sure. Yeah. Doorway. Can I have to put... I don't... I doubt it matters. Wow. Wow. I'm sad about that. Like, what can you... A, a table? Like when you... Yeah, that was my there? next answer. That was my next answer. You're, he's, he's sweeping it. He's sweeping everything up. It might not he's even be... He's going to be there. One of them. You kidding me? Well, you're it's right. Bump your head. Jesus. Wow, this is hard. Uh, bump your head. What do people actually bump their head on? Other people's heads. <laughs> On your friend's heads. Desk. Right? I, I've i done that. Yeah, but isn't that the same as table? Oh, frick. <laughs> okay. I'll give you another chance. Because I don't think there's any way this is on the board. <laughs> R and M ains. Another's. <laughs> another's. Another head. That's right. I mean, that happens all the time. Bump your head on. Accidentally bump your head. Especially on the playground, which I haven't been on for a while. Bump your heads on. Jeez, this is... Do you think an oven, maybe? <laughs> Cabinet? I don't know. Well, we don't, we'll never know now. Oh, good. Are we just complete idiots or what? Uh... Oh, mothers? Now, if this isn't number one, then oh, I, don't, I didn't even what's think of that. On? I didn't even think of that. It's the whole purpose of their job, right? That was so good. I'm playing. I really hope you can't steal this from me if I don't get it all. All right. So. Yours, I, yours. I should have been quicker on the draw there. How about this one? 
I should have been quicker on the draw. What do you think about this answer? Is it going to be there? Mm, no. Ah! Oh! It's there. How about this one? Yeah, I knew you were going to say that. I'm kind of out of I'm out of uh, answers now. No, I didn't know you were gonna say that. Oh, right? No. You might be helping me out. What starts with A T? Oh my lord! So, Beer's pants is doing a good job. You know, he's he's really doing a good job here. Let's give it a shot. See, that's something I thought of, but then he was wrong, you know? Okay, I got a better one. Oh, I was going to say that. That's what I was yeah. thinking. I bet you were. Yes. Hmm. This is it. This is it. What else could be there? Hmm, photographed. Oh, man. I was going to say teachers. <laughs> You're not supposed to give me answers. It's not a good one, though, so it doesn't matter. Uh, dog catchers. Child? That's not an occupation. I know. It should be, though. I guess it kind of is. I mean, you do get paid with stuff. You photographed. Stuff. You photographed a lot. Oh, I got it. Magicians. I don't have enough time, though. Magicians. No, no. Not magicians. I think I got the answer. I only have one more chance, though, don't I? Uh, I think I got it. You lost that one. That's okay. That answer was wrong. I think I have it. Oh! Musician. Might not be there. It might not. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> it's not there. Yeah, this is hard. Yeah, it sure is. Who's, who's you know, photo? <clears throat> every time this process comes up, I try to talk like you to distract you, and it, I don't think it's worked once. How many monies do you have to come up to to win? 74,000 million. No, really, how much is it? 200. So you're almost there. Well, this 178 is for that. If that's an answer, I'm going to be so angry. It, well, if you lose this, I am there. I Good. You won? Yeah. Oh. Uh, what every, is this, I wonder? You're on, you're done? <laughs> yeah. Uh, Policemen. Are they That's... photographed a lot? <laughs> I don't think so. I'm done. Probably not as often as the criminals are, right? Where did I go? I don't know. Where did you go? I guess I should play the fast money. Lion Read these ball. for me. It'll help. What? Okay. Can you name a color? Blue. That's what I was going to say. I'm looking at an awful lot of it. Uh, I know. Supermarkets. I know. Viewers, I mean, can I, should I tell him? Wait, this isn't good. No, I can't tell you. It would be cheating. It has to be open. Does that matter? I know what it, I know a great one, viewers. Holiday? Yeah, should... that's it. That's the one I was going to say. Are they open, though? And can I spell it? And I'm going to run out of time for the rest of the answers. Sure am. Are they open on Thanksgiving? Dude, are they open any holiday? I don't think it means that. How does it... How would it not? Thanksgiving. Uh... You said Thanksgiving. <laughs> I think it actually maybe just ran out of space. Oh, well, this one. You know what, viewers, let me tell you something. I like to Don't watch yet. ASMR Name a kind of videos. station. I like to watch ASMR videos where people light matches. Don't do it yet. I'm trying to focus. They light matches and, and like candles and stuff and and just on matchbooks. And they go through all they these matches. Because they go, choo, 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 through all these matches. You know what I mean? And I think it sounds relaxing, so I like to watch that. But they waste all these matches, you know. I blame you for not me not being able to finish scramble. Scrap. You're a butthole. I'm sorry. I didn't mean it. <laughs> <laughs> what? The radio station? How was that not 
Okay, I was thinking of something else. I get it now. Name any color. Okay. Go with it. No, the other big one is obviously red. Name a holiday. Okay. <clears throat> Halloween is not a holiday, but it would definitely be... It's got to be... Christmas. Right. Can I skip? Yeah, the thing is, it's not open on Christmas. There's no way. Nothing is. Christmas. Ow! I might as well put it. I can't waste as much time on this answer as we did last time. Want me to help you? No. Light a match with. Car fuel. No. Barbecue. I hope that, you know, counts. BBQ. Name it's a kind of station. Short. So now it means something like train or bus. Shining time station. What? Shining time station. You remember okay. that? Scramble is going to be worth so much, too. Didn't you watch that when you were a little baby? What is it? You don't remember that? It's a show that Ringo was the conductor on. Ringo Starr? Yeah. I don't have a clue what you're talking he about. He was on a kid's show. He was a train conductor on a kid's show. Uh, Christmas apparently is an answer. BBQ it doesn't like. What? Train station? That's what I told you. I still won anyway. Ringo was a train conductor. How could... I See, I want to know the top answers now for the thing. On the TV show, they tell you. How could... What else do you think you would light with a match? And what the hell does it mean by station? If radio and train are not... Do you want to... Do you want to challenge me? I'll do whatever you want. Challenge me. viewers want. I gotta go to bed, but challenge me. I won... I know, you got rid of my family. <laughs> now I need a new one. Oh, I mean, man, you didn't I... really get rid of my family. They, they just had to go home. I'm well, stuck with the M family. This guy, he doesn't look his... Look, his shirt's ripped. The guy, the guy's ripped his shirt. Look. Which guy? My guy. He said you can see his whole stomach. Look at that. I don't see it. They are the right here. Oh, now it's not. Hey, this is the same family. The high school guy? Dude, I got the same family again. I think it might be the same family every single time. Yours wasn't. I think it might have been. I guess I'll be Lyme again then. Since it's the same family. <laughs> yeah. I was going to pick a different name because that would be different, but they're the same. I don't think that... Are you talking about the guy on the far right? His shirt was ripped? Is that what you were saying? Yeah, but it says high school. I don't think it looked that way. I'm going to need to look again. I didn't know I had the same fam. I wonder if this is yeah, lasting see, too long. <laughs> it's belly you thought button. that was his see, belly? See his belly button? <laughs> That's hilarious. Oh my god. Oh, you're the same guys. You're so... Okay. You know, I'm going to tell you something, viewers. I'm not a fan of pirates. I've, I never enjoyed pirates, you know? Do like, you know any? I'd see pirate movies when I was a kid, like so, and I wouldn't like it. I'd be like, oh, pirates are so boring, you know? Like, all they, they go, Rawr, and they look so dirty and stuff. What's know? the name of that uh, Johnny Depp character? I don't even know. You it's obviously not in this game. This game, right? Yeah, yeah. I was just saying, just, you know, because... Well, you, you just won. Yeah, I think I'll play, I guess. You won. I... I well, got two like answers. A guy who would know a lot of pirates. Today. I don't really. I have two answers that are almost identical. <laughs> Blue beard and red beard. I would think out loud, but I'm afraid I might give something away. Jeez, that didn't work, eh? Fictional or real? Were there really any real pirates? Well, I guess. Of yeah. course. But like that, anyone knows about? Do you know any? Must have been. Yeah, maybe. I don't know. Maybe I do, maybe I don't. But... I definitely have... Aren't those pirates? Jeez. I shouldn't have picked this one. I don't know any other fictional ones. Well, I mean, those probably were fictional ones. Do I but... get to do any? Yeah, of course. What is a pirate's name? Wow. I have no idea. I think Shoelaces Jackson was one. Shoeless Joe Jackson? Yeah. 
<laughs> Every time I, I mention that guy, I forget his name. I always call him Shoelaces Johnson. That's weird. I can't believe you heard of that guy. It's kind of famous. <laughs> yeah, but it's a long time ago. I think you'd know. You ever heard of Captain Fogg? <laughs> Who's that? <laughs> I was at a time, so I just forfeited. Have you ever heard of uh, Babe Ruth? No one's ever heard of Babe Ruth. <laughs> Especially with a name like Babe, it makes it even more unlikely to hear about him. <laughs> you know, like Yogi or something like that. Longbeard? <laughs> Every good beard. Uh, Long John Silver. I was going to say, is there a pirate in Moby Dick? Yeah, that's the next guy I'm going to do. Well, you don't get another one, so... Oh, yeah, Captain Ahab. Ahab? Well, he's not a pirate, though. He's just a... He's, he's you missed a... the R. I can't do it. Are you kidding me? It won't let me. Uh-oh. Long John might be good enough. It won! Blind time. Well, Long John Silver, he may have been a real guy, right? I'm not sure. Blackbeard. Oh, my Blue God. Beard. I told you, Bluebeard. Captain Kidd. Oh, yeah, he's a fan. Did you realize I guessed Blackbeard? Yeah, but you didn't put it together. <laughs> I know. And I said Bluebeard, too. I absolutely hate this game. You love Who it. had a blue beard? How is that even possible? You love it. Which girl do you think is hotter, mine or yours there? It's hard to tell. Well, I better do this because you love wow. Vegas. Was that a distraction? Because you, you I didn't even people look. gamble in, at, in Las Vegas. I didn't even look at the question. Viewers, he... Pants is a huge fan of Las Vegas. A huge fan. He went there. That's how big a fan he is. I'm guaranteed to win this category, I think. Yes! I just realized that if I put in... Um, if I actually got Blackbeard, though, I would have ended up just... You would have just ended up getting more points. So it's a good thing it didn't count it. You're the one that got screwed. <clears throat> right? I don't get it. Oh, I get it! Yeah. Crap. Oh, I thought of that. Why didn't you put it? So I, didn't think it I don't know. I didn't know it was a real game. Oh, you beat me. I know all the games. I mean, this is... Oh, you're going to win. Well, I mean, I know a lot of them anyway. You're weak. I know the f popular ones. Jukebox, right? This one's probably number one. Jukebox? Is that like uh, the slots? Shh. Don't give you any hints. Blackjack. I was going to say Blackjack. Oh, It's not called 21, but okay. Some whatever. people call it 21. People don't know what it's called. I can't believe it. I was, I was thinking Blackjack, too, but I thought poker first, you know? Oh, crap. Roulette. You got to know how to spell to play these games. Well, that's because you don't read. <laughs> Except I... Spell pretty well, I think. You read books and things, like, <clears throat> you know. What else is there? You, might as well you just play sense. Call of Duty all day. <laughs> it's definitely not true. I haven't played that for like a week at least. Hmm. What else? Line Popsicle doesn't play... Name a game, people. Doesn't play new games, viewers. He only plays Nintendo, Super Nintendo, Sega, and and Sega Genesis and DOS games. I'm not too worried about you stealing this from me, but... Can you come up with one? Is it your turn? Yeah. It's hard to think when you talk, but of course you have to talk. It's an LP. I know. I was thinking of Baccarat. You know that game called Baccarat? You know that game? What's that? Yeah. Are you actually... You know I can actually pick it still, right? Oh. I think it might... I think that's just a variation of poker, I'm pretty sure. I didn't know what it is. Um, I think they play the game of dice. Yeah, that's craps. Oh, yeah. Cups. Don't they play I, guess what under... Which one's <laughs> under the cup? Are you trying to distract me or are you actually guessing? I'm serious, this, isn't that... Don't they play, like, a game what's under a cup? You're not supposed to help me, though, remember? What's that game called? That's not a real thing. That's what magicians do to this. 
don't actually, don't actually play that, no. <laughs> you would lose every time. I mean, I guess you kind of do eventually anyway, but... Guess what balls and... <clears throat> wow, I'm... I don't know what the last one is. Hmm. What is it? Okay, let me think. Yeah. Oh, I got it. I really hope not. I really hope not. If I get it, do I win everything? Yes. Well, that'd be cool. Oh. Is it line time, folks, or is it still pants? Alright. It's up to you. Can you do it? I really hope not. I don't know if people play this in Vegas or not, but people love to play it a lot at places outdoors and stuff, so. Outdoors? Well, inside doors and stuff. <laughs> oh, crap. That could be it. Bingo? Oh, oh, that was a good answer. Dang it! F1! F! M! Keto! Uh, yeah. I've heard of that, but I don't know what it is. I think it's kind of like bingo, but... Hey, I you think we should do an, an LP of a casino kid, like one of those casino games? Would you like to do that? I have no idea. Because you love casinos and stuff. I really don't like casinos that much. What's a health club? Like a gym? Where people go to, you know, for health things. Like the YMCA? What? There's no spa in a health club? Since when? Where's the health in spas? Are you kidding me? People go to soak in them and then and, and feel healthy. Did they? What did you say? Gym. I guess that's not the kind Jim of thing. Jim is a health matter. club, isn't it? Part of I thought it was just part no, of it. No, you're right, maybe. I don't know. Maybe if something found in health clubs. Uh... Perhaps I have no idea what a health club is. Maybe it just means Jim. It's <laughs> and it's the machines. It would be really interesting fun. if Cat made a treadmill video. <laughs> yeah, of course it would. <laughs> Maybe she'll do it on the show. Wow. You don't find that either. Do you want to just... Maybe we... I should just not answer this. Yeah. I'm not going to... I, I want a... I want a new category. Can I do so, it? No. Vitamins. I wonder... I was going to go with pool, but I don't want you to be able to steal and win. Vitamins. Just move on. I'm not going to tell them. No. Screw that question. Viewer, that's a good thing for the viewers to write in because they can't actually cheat with that one, right? Uh, I mean, maybe what do you can... put in your ear? <laughs> uh, Water. Finger. That's probably one of the answers. Yeah, I just as I was saying it, that's a V, not a U. Yeah, I know, I do that all the time. Yeah. I think the viewers should try to tell us what they think is in a a health club. Earplug. Or tell us what a health club is. Because <laughs> apparently we don't know. Yes! Can you do it better? Probably, though. Well, I'm going to go with fingers, obviously. Well, I guess it's not obvious. but I said earplugs. Yeah, it's a great answer, of course. I bet you're going to win. This is what... And then you say, la, 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 la. Or something like that. Oh, you wow. lost. Wow. <laughs> Okay. Um, wow. Um, I don't know. Would I want to do this category? You think but I remember? Should... You, if you don't do it, you you still need to be able to steal at the end to win. Yeah. Don't forget that. Yeah. I guess I'll do it. Okay. What's the score in this game anyway? I'd like to know. Q-tip. Aren't you going to give a uh, disclaimer here? It seems so like you to do that. Whoa! <laughs> Why was that so shocking? Cotton swab, it said. Okay. What What's else wrong with that? Here? 
Um, dust. <laughs> Banana. Dirt. Banana. Uh, this is hard. Yeah, it is. Headphone. Where's the H? Oh. <laughs> right beside. So I'm tired of viewers. Headphones. Yes! Nice. Did Walkmans exist at the time? Yeah, they did. They In right the on. early 80s, they were invented, I think. How many viewers do you think don't know what a Walkman is? Do you think there's any? I'm thinking. More than zero? Uh, what do you put in your ear? What do you put in your ear? Sure you are. Uh, Clock radio. Oh! <laughs> Elephant tusk. Close. Down to the wire. You did it. Yes! Good one. Hearing aid! Yes! <laughs> okay. Uh, what do you put in your ear? <laughs> I really don't know. I should think too. Just in case. <clears throat> Earring. Oops. I don't think that goes in your ear, but ear earring. I better not. Yes. Be. That is so stupid. Yes, viewers, earrings. Okay, what else did you put in your ear? I need <sighs> one more thing. I guess in a weird, bizarre way, it earring. is in. Uh, Just a different kind of in. I know you don't put it in your ear, but that definitely better not work or I'll be pooping all over my floor. Oh, darn it. All right, <laughs> what do you put in your ear? Uh, do you know? No, I don't. Sound? <laughs> Every once in a while I pick up a word and I just jam it in my ear. <laughs> <laughs> toes? No. Uh, what do you put in your ear? No, it's unlikely that toes is an answer. Ear. Uh, I have an answer, but I don't think it's on there. You should be taking it out, but <laughs> if you want to put it back in, that's fine. It's. I don't think this is it, but you yeah. have to pick it. You know. Yeah, one more try. Earwax. I'm uh, nervous, though. I don't have an answer. You put in your ear. You don't? No. <sighs> Maybe a cleaning device? Uh, I don't know how fingers is not an answer. It must be toes. For the contortionists out you there. You put in your ears. <laughs> uh, <laughs> uh, Pussy willow. Um, what do you put in your ears? Did that guy from Adam's family ever put a light bulb in his ears? <laughs> <laughs> I hope you don't steal this. Seriously, I hope you don't steal this, man. I kind of think, oh no, you won't win if I don't, so that's okay. If I do, I win. I, I only have... You win the whole game? Yeah. That sucks. I have an answer, but it's a bad one. It's really bad. Oh, let me think if I can think of anything else real quickly. What oh, was I it? I come up with one. Well, I'm gonna... What was your other answer? I don't have another one. You said you had a bad answer. Yeah, this is it. Eardrums? I'm forced to go with it. Eardrops? Oh, frick! Oh, eardrops! Oh, wow! Oh, oh. Wow! Oh. I'm shocked that that was on there. 
I can't even believe it. I did all that, viewers, and he won. That's why this game sucks, man. <laughs> I worked so hard. And I got every answer except that. You know what? When this came up... Even sport does not have cheerleaders. When I read sport, I was like, what the hell does that word mean? Can you believe that? No. I didn't know what that word was. Hockey has cheerleaders. No, it doesn't. Yeah, it does. Well, not at the time it didn't. I've seen them. No, it didn't back Just then. Just Robin. Name a month. I don't have a clue. Viewers, I'm a big fan of cheerleaders. So, I know, like, I, you know, but, you know. Hockey Very few teams have game. them, like the LA Kings or something. But it's got, it's got cheerleaders now. You know who else doesn't have cheerleaders? Uh, doesn't soccer not have cheerleaders? Yeah, I don't think so. Neither does baseball. It should be even Neither does baseball. Neither does cricket. Whipped cream. What do you put whipped okay. cream on? Swim teams don't have cheerleaders. Pie? Uh, I think they're looking for a mainstream sport. Ice skating. That doesn't have cheerleaders. It'd be weird if it did. What about cheerleading? Yeah, oh, wait, I guess it does. Have cheerleading. Yeah, it does. But it does. It does. <laughs> yeah. it does. Summer clothes. You almost okay. fooled me with that one. I fooled myself. When do they do it? When is, when is summer? July? Yeah. Irish dance doesn't have cheerleaders. <laughs> that would be awesome if it did. Dancing. <laughs> Wouldn't it be weird if, if, if Irish dance, uh, dance had cheerleaders? Wouldn't that be funny? It would be. <laughs> wow. When? July? Yeah. And then, oh, and then if, if the cheerleaders dance better dude, than the dancers, dude. then then it would be like a fight or something, right? Dude, I'm I'm dominating this game this time. No, but you know what? It would be cool if cheerleading had cheerleaders, like for the cheerleaders. Yeah, that would it's be like cool. Like Inception cheerleaders. Yeah. Be awesome. Yeah. Oh, that's February, hot. March, April, that's May, hot. February, March. It probably depends on the where you live. You know what, Let's viewers? March. Viewers, I'd like to see Cat do a cheerleading. Do cheerleading. You gave me two friggin' month things. Well, you want to know something? Didn't she do one? No. Did she at least have pom poms? No, that was Jennifer Love Hewitt. No, in one of those weird YouTube videos. No, she never did that. She should have. But I guess. they're not going to have her do that in Two Broke Girls. They never have her do anything. What do you put that. whipped cream on, man? They never have her do anything that guys would like. Can you give me an answer? Except for in the Martha Stewart family. I don't eat whipped cream ever. Apples is not the right answer. Name it's the month the people month. start wearing summer February, clothes. March, oh, April. you want to know what month it is? I'll tell you. Is it in that song by that guy? What's it called? Neil Sedaka? Does he ever sing about it? Every month is in Calendar Girl. Yeah, but does he say they start wearing clothes because they, you know. <laughs> June. It worked all right. I knew it. What's what's the good best answer? I don't know. July. Well, what were you going to answer? No, I, that was my other one. Oh. I only got two for July. May? Maybe. Yeah, I mean, it depends on, this is probably like a, well, I don't know, in California, do you always wear summer clothes? Probably, right? Okay, well, do, it doesn't really do, get cold. They, do you want us to stop yours, or should we keep going? <laughs> do you know how long we've been playing for? Oh, wait, you know, Cause John, I do. Jonathan R, Jonathan R and Beat Chef said we should keep going. Did they really? Yeah. The oh. rest of them said they're tired, but they, they want us to do one more, that's what they said. I think I guess, we think we should because they've been supporting us for a long time. I guess the people who don't want to see it can just stop watching. Yeah, it. if they want. But hey, if other people out there you want to keep watching, keep watching, because uh, we we like having everyone out there. We and let us hear from you, and then maybe we'll give you a shout out in a future video. We'll we'll mention your names. Oh, like, definitely. You know, if you start supporting us a lot and we see your names come up a lot, then you'll hear our voices speak your names, <laughs> like and, Tina or something. And that'd be exciting, you know. Ooh. Whatever her name was, Tina or Tiana. There was a I can't girl. Remember. She disappeared, but you know. There's some girl named something Garcia or something. Maybe it's not a girl though, actually. There's a guy think. like there's a guy that asked me like a new fan. He said he just subscribed recently. He said that he he loved my voice and he wanted me to teach him how to sing on Skype. 
Oh yeah, I, I remember that guy. Yeah, I forget what his name is though, but shout out to you, whoever your name is. How about that guy with that really messed up avatar? With that guy with like his eyes bulging. Yeah, yeah, that stuff. guy's there a lot too. What's his name? I can't remember. Yeah, guy with the eyes with bulging out <laughs> avatar, shout out to you. If they made it this far. That's the challenge. This is how we'll know. Yeah. <laughs> Was it my there's also there's also a guy who has a Ninja Turtles avatar, so that's pretty cool. I'm well, down with that. Lance is a huge fan of Ninja Turtles. Michelangelo, I believe. I'm getting tired, so I'm slurring now. There's also a guy with who subscribed with an avatar that's an album cover of In Flames, which most people probably don't know about. I don't know what that is. But... They're actually my favorite band, so I think that person's pretty cool. Well, why didn't you tell him earlier? I told him right now. Yeah, That's well, good yeah, you it? tell him like five hours into the video. <laughs> well, I don't, I, whatever. Here we go. Uh, I didn't read that very well. Name Tony, occupation which a man uses his good looks. Tony Danza. <laughs> <laughs> Can I say acting? I don't think so. I would pick actor if I were you. It says occupation, though. Yeah, actor is the occupation. Acting is the thing that you do. You better be right. If you shrew me on this, and it says acting, I'm gonna... It probably... It might accept both. Actor. I better not be acting there, man. I doubt it is. I'm gonna arrest you. Hmm. Maybe I should just. I Police mean, you're, man. <laughs> yeah, you're more than welcome to use the. Uh, you're you're into models. You're just into every model there is. It's just the it's the right answer. Oh, uh, and I do. You win. It's pretty obvious, isn't it? Hmm. Should I play? Yeah, I guess so. Policeman. Now, was this true in the 80s? Yeah, kind of, right? So, I'll go with it. Not as much so as it is now, but we'll go with it. Yeah, the 80s is when that started, really, because, because of the music videos, you know? By the way, that song, I Think We're Alone Now, is garbage. I listened to it the other day, and it's so bad. Which version? There's more than one version? Yeah, there's a bunch of versions. Oh, well, who did it first? The original version was by... Tommy James and the Shondells in the 60s. Well, that song was probably good. It was definitely the execution of the song. It wasn't, like, I mean... Yeah, that, the original version, the original was a hit in the 1967, I think it was, by Tommy James and the Shondells, and then it was remade, it was remade by the Rubinos in the late 70s, and it was remade by, and then it was remade by Lenny Lovitch. She it's did it in the 70s. It's a poorly written song. So and I can believe that the others are not crap. I just came up with an answer that I didn't have enough time to So play. a lot of people have done that song and had tried to have a hit with it. But of course the bit, the most popular version was Tiffany's version. The uh, That was the biggest hit version of it. This is especially relevant for the time. Isn't it? I do like Tiffany's the best, but some of them are... Uh, eh? Good. Isn't this especially relevant for when this game was made? Well, because Ronald Reagan is such a great looking guy. <laughs> yeah, that's not who I was talking about, but yeah. What are you talking about? Well, the rest of them. Bill Clinton wasn't president yet. I don't talk about him either. George Bush? I don't know who was president at the time, actually. Well, when was this game made? I have no idea. What? It doesn't really matter. I mean, if the person was I'm president... I'm guessing that George Bush was eight president. Eight years old earlier. That'd be I'm guessing that the original George Bush was president when this game was made. I doubt he had a reputation for being good looking. No, he didn't. Uh, name of the man uses his good looks. What about a Kennedy? They're supposed to be good looking, aren't they? I don't really know. That's why that one guy was <laughs> banging interns all the time. Wasn't he, or whatever they are? What, <laughs> what the hell is an HH hair? I was trying to put hairdresser, but it didn't work. Here, here. <laughs> <laughs> hairdresser? I don't think you really use that. This is where we find out if acting was... What is that guy doing over there? He's something, something dirty, that guy. Your, your father is always doing something. Oh, oh Jesus. Okay. All right. <laughs> the whole game was changed because of this. 
Oh, man. I don't know what to do. I guess we should just restart this one, right? Yeah. It's the only fair you thing to do, me. I think. You threw me. It's the only fair Let's thing Let's look at the do. date on the game. Okay. Well, you missed it. Where was it? It wasn't that screen didn't... You had never to wait change. a bit. No. Look. I've, I've, I've done... wait. Oh, I think it was before that. Do a hard reset. I don't know how to. You just do hard instead of soft. Yeah, I don't know how to do... I don't know the keyboard shortcut. Alright, never mind. I'm, I'm guessing it's made about 1990, and if so, then George Bush was the president. The older George Bush, obviously. George <laughs> H. Bush, was it, or...? Uh, yeah, I know it's George W. Yeah, I know that. Oh, yeah, it was George H., I think. And his wife was... Does everybody remember who his wife was? Do you remember, Pants? I, I still don't know. Barbara Bush. It's not Laura. No, Barbara Bush. And it's not uh, Jenna. No, you like Jenna, though. You have a thing for her, right? No. Yeah, you I don't even know. What, I don't even know. You know who's hot, viewers? I'd like to know. Do you know who I think is hot? Politician's daughter, I think is hot? I'll tell you. Is it Sarah Palin's daughter? Did you see... What? Never mind. No, Megan Kane. The, her, uh... No, uh -huh. John... No, Megan McCain, or whatever her name is. Uh, you know, John McCain's daughter. John McCain's daughter, yeah. Yeah, she's pretty hot. I like her. How old is his wife? She's a lot younger than him. Yeah, I could, doesn't she have a reputation for being kind of good looking? Well, I thought she was, you know, but you didn't, no. I said one time I thought she'd be, like, the best looking, like, first lady that you've ever had. And you were like, you know, you looked her up and you're like, uh, bleh. That's, that's got to be... Some hyperbole of some kind. But I, I thought she's I thought she's a good looking woman. We should vote the next election, vote for the person with the most attractive wife. That's my advice. So for you mean you you mean Bill Clinton? <laughs> no. Because Hillary Clinton is gonna be running, so you'd mean Bill oh, Clinton as a wife? Is that what you mean? He's the most attractive wife, sure. <laughs> Name the most important person in the history of America. Wow, there's a lot of Names that could be here. Uh, Bill Clinton. He comes up again. Are you act? Oh, never mind. <laughs> For a second, I thought you were gonna pick George Bush. Would be so <laughs> stupid. <laughs> you know, I, I shouldn't have said. I, I should have said someone else, but I, I don't want to say who though, because I know Pants is gonna say it. I know you're gonna say it. Well, I got a lot of names in my head. Oh, okay. There's so many. Well, how am I going to get this in? Pick up the pace here. Well, of course, this guy is very important. Yeah. I can't put his name in. Yeah, I don't think it matters. I think it just figures it out. Yes! I won! Good one. Well, George Washington was the first president of the United States of America. Did you know that, Pants? Yeah. Because Johnny, Johnny didn't know that at one point. Unless I'm mistaken, but... Two Canadians knew, but an American didn't? Well, that's okay. I forgive him. I think, like, I've, I I think he missed... But, like, I don't know. I might be wrong. Did he say it was Lincoln instead? Who you're putting no, in right no, now? I, I, I don't know. I may be wrong. But he, he there's some things he didn't know about American history I was shocked at. Cause Did I, he say Jimmy Carter? I know. Um... It's kind of not really important knowledge anyway, so it doesn't really matter. I like Richard Nixon. The viewers are going to be a fall off their seats here as I said that you now. <laughs> yeah, you're probably right about that. Yeah. Abraham Lincoln. Yes! I win! Okay, the most important person in history of America. Uh, I think I'm going to be able to steal this, to be honest with you. There's so many names, I don't know how you could come up with all of them. Yeah. I was thinking of him, too. I mean, he kind of, in a very weird way, that is, it's kind of... an American, though. No, it doesn't need to be. He couldn't be, because there was no America. It's an out of outside-of-the-box answer. Yes! Christopher Columbus! Yeah. Getting them in order, viewers. You are getting them in order. Okay, the most important person in history of America. William M. Gaines, the publisher of Mad Magazine? <laughs> Oh, um... Yeah, I got some great answers. 
I really hope they're up there. Teddy? It could be either. I was thinking Franklin Roosevelt, actually. Oh. Well, Teddy's got a better name. Well, he was... Franklin Roosevelt was in World War II, though, so... Yeah, but his name's not as good. D didn't Teddy, like, uh, beat the crap out of Mexicans or something? Uh, they wouldn't count it. When the Mexicans were trying to invade something, or... I don't know. Yeah, it's Dead American War or something? I don't know. Yeah. Who's an important guy? I got some great... Oh, well, I know, I know. I know about presidents, you know. Yeah, you can come up with a bunch of them. Oh, man, I think I tried... What was that other answer I had? I mean, Kennedy oh, right, was pretty right, darn that. important. Oh, dude, I got a, I got a good one. I should have said it. Could I have another chance? Yeah, you get another shot. You saw Don't only have one strike. Ah, <clears throat> oh, that's ridiculous. You know what? You probably would have been safer to just put Ron or Kennedy because it probably would have accepted any of them. Yeah. Elvis. Well, that's right. Yeah. I think that's think so. way too far out of the box. We're a poor, pretty important. Uh, yeah, that's what I'm saying. Yeah, oh, that's what, really even that important. Yeah, of course he is. He's, he's significant, but I don't know about important. Change music. He changed music. Elvis Presley. You kidding me? It's not an important thing. It's most, anyway, he changed the whole thing. This guy is uh, Elvis Presley. Yeah. You better. Uh, that's right. Yeah. Let's get it done there, Elvis. Right. All right, I got. I tell you, I've got two answers. Elvis isn't here. I can't believe it. Elvis is not there. I'm thinking Ben Franklin or Martin Luther King. I thought of him. I thought of him right after Elvis. I thought of him. I was gonna say, I thought of Martin Luther King right after. I I think I'm gonna go with Martin Luther King. Someone's got to have, you know. But it's I can't just believe be. that. I can't believe John F. Kennedy wasn't there though. I don't know, man. I'm not going to come anywhere close to fitting this. I really hope it just figures it out. I think I think William M. Gaines should be in there for the publisher of Mad Magazine. What about Ben Franklin? Yeah, he's important. Oh, no! Uh, I think I know, actually. I think I figured out. Well, say them ahead of time so we can say... You can, can I say do it? Right. Yeah. Thomas Jefferson. No. Thomas Edison. Oh, ben is. Franklin! Oh, there he is. Thomas Jefferson! Oh, he is there. I was right. Uh, I should have went with Franklin. I got another one, viewers. We're Canadians, you know, but we know more about American history than a lot you of people. You know Americans. what the problem is? The people who wrote made this game are racist. That's what it is. Uh, don't don't say that. Come on. I'm just making a joke, you realize. If you would have just laughed, it would have been fine. Alright. I'm gonna I'm going to get this one. What do you think? Oh, crap. I forgot. A European was... country? What would it be? <laughs> do you know? I have a lot of answers. That's one of them. <laughs> Oh, I know. Yeah, dude, how can you leave out Ali's egg? Come yeah, on. that's what I should have said. Oh, you silly I just goose. thought of that right after, you know. And you know who's better than Ali's egg viewers is Francois. Francois Gall. Yeah, France Gall and Francois <laughs> Hardy. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Francois um, Hardy. I don't know. They don't dance as well. She's the best. She didn't dance at all, but Francois Hardy is the best. She's not female. as good as Ali Zay then. She's the best female French singer of all time. Oh, okay. Edith PF, obviously. You know. If you're a viewer that doesn't know who Ali Zay is, you should YouTube it. See, yeah, I thought that right after said Italy, you know. And watch her dance. She's got a great dance. What's that song called? Jean Aimer? Yeah. Is that what it's called? How would you not? You watched it like 500 times one day. Yeah, but I don't speak French, so the words, you know, I just don't know. What, I don't I don't know. Jean Jean I'm fed up is the English translation. Yeah, Jean Aimer. 
And also, you should look up the English translation. The song is crazy weird. Right? Remember when we did that? Yeah, it is, yeah. I forgot that I need to play this game. Play it! There, there's so many potential Name answers there. Not, I'm not going to name them for you. Oh. How many, like, there's so many that could be that last one, right? France, England, Italy. Yeah, I think I'm going to have to go with... Portugal. Don't be ridiculous. Mm. Dutch. Poland. Yeah, that's... Especially if you want to do some drugs. No, okay. viewers, viewers. You go there to visit Fleur. Okay. Do you guys have to... Oh, my God, it counted I can't it. believe you got that. I pressed the wrong button, accidentally ended it, and it counted. I All I put in was germ. Really? <laughs> yes. Wow. Wow. I was going to go with Ireland So, viewers, Scotland. go tell it's... Let Me ASMR at Fleur to watch our videos. Name an occupation that requires a steady hand. I didn't really... Yeah, you just I bust guess. in. Well, I had an answer, but, uh, I don't know, I kind of felt like I, I wanted to... I thought you were going to say a surrogate mother. I wanted time to think, and then you, you know, go afterwards. Oh, unbelievable. Mm. That's good, actually. I don't really know if I want to do this. I have no idea what the answer could be. A steady hand? My God. What should I do? Lime. This is a long LP. Clazy's play. <laughs> Alright. Um, stenographer? <laughs> That's probably not true. It doesn't need to be steady. Uh, steady hands. Um, steady hands. Oh, man. A big brother. It's probably a sport of some kind, which I probably shouldn't have said. Why did I say that? Just in case you come Steady up with hands. one. Husband? Don't try to unpack that one, because I don't even know what it meant. Um, wow, he's using that uh, that annoying buzzword. What's that annoying buzzword? Unpack. You said that. You did. Oh, you're right, I did. New York Beach <laughs> requires a steady hand. Uh, How did that happen? Like My brain is maybe? broken. That's a good guess, but um, remember. What's your turn? <laughs> it's my turn. I thought it was mine. Uh, How about a butcher? Dude. <laughs> uh, I'm going to teach you a lesson. Why, that's not there. It might be. Why would it be? I don't know. I don't have another answer, so it doesn't really matter. I don't think it's there. I think you do need a steady hand. Okay, but I gotta, I'm gotta. i going to think with these remaining seven seconds here. Teacher. Ah, uh, uh, I got one. I think. Taxi oh. driver. I hope. Piano. Pain. Painter. Oh, that's a good one. That's a good one. House paint. Okay. Um, what about the other type of painter? Does that count? You know? Artist? Artist. I don't know. Oh! Okay. The only thing this is doing, though, is giving you more points or making it more hard for you. I have two answers, but I'm I guess I could get what they points. are. It's... Hmm. One of them is because I knew a guy that did this, and he got a... Uh, like a disease that made his hand shake, you know, so he, he was finding it hard to do this anymore, this this thing. And so that's why I'm guessing it. I think I know what you're talking about. What? 
I don't... Well, do you promise not to say it if it isn't that? I don't know how you could. Yeah, I believe you. Uh, it's uh, like a, a tailor or something. No. But that's Sower. a good one, though. It's a guitarist. Oh. Okay, you're not spelling that right. <laughs> I don't know what you just did. <laughs> I really... You don't need a... St Dude, why do you keep doing that? I'm not doing it on purpose. I just... I hit the keys hard. You know how I am. It's like Goro on the keys. I would say, in my professional opinion, you do not need a steady hand for that. That's because you're drunk when you do it a lot, I guess. Well, there you go. I was going to say construction worker. That's what carpenter is. Diamond cutter. That would have been hard to get. Dentist. Yeah. That's a good one. Welder. Hmm. Those are tough. Could have got dentist. Yeah, could have gotten dentist. Not diamond sure. cutter, though. I won again. You win again? I it's guess so. Over? I'm sorry. I can't believe I'm sorry. Over I thought you were the... the Wait a second. Team. Didn't I Same win the part. first three games? Or was I it two? the first two. Was it two or three? Birthday. Uh, Did I win two or three? Two. That's it? <laughs> yeah. I thought I was great. I know. At the beginning, it looked like you were the king, but... You, the Elf. game... I, I, I was lucky enough to get a chance to, you know, come back. I well, consider I'm myself lucky. After how many years of marriage should a couple have a child? I thought it was going to say, I mean, divorce, like, immediately, basically. One or two or three, I don't know. Why? It's the most days you've ever gone without bathing. <laughs> Jesus. Most? Two? Three? Are you kidding? I go seven every week. <laughs> Don't tell them that. How much in <laughs> dollars does average family spend a week on food? Jeez, I don't man. smell bad. Don't don't tell the viewers <laughs> that. It was so dumb. Hey, you think anybody's still awake at this point? <laughs> How many hours do you, do you watch TV? Probably a lot. No, I'm kidding, viewers. Line popsicle. He showers every day. Yeah, there you go. Every morning. These are some good answers. I'm good at this game, apparently. I mean, this vert part. Well, of you're it. not tired, either. You couldn't win a single one of these. Are you tired? So tired. Okay. Do you know what else has your birthday? Because I don't. Driver's I'm just going to skip this one. I already picked that. Health card. It's almost impossible for me to not win now with these number of questions. I only need five things. What's the most days you go without bathing? <laughs> Should I put in seven? How many? <laughs> how many yeah, I'd like to know how many do seven. I'd like to know. <laughs> not many. I'm just curious. You do it seven. Oh, yeah, I go at least uh, like a month usually. <laughs> Nice. Alright, buddy. Uh, I would have 15,000. This is a live stream. You're up to 5,000. I had 15 if we didn't reset the game. Wow. We should count I, that as 15. I, I, I think I'm the winner. I challenge Billy MC to this game. You think we should go again? <laughs> You're kidding, right? No. Oh my god. Are you serious? Hey, if you're... Do you think we should go again? That seems like the most craziest idea. I hope you're going to post this all in one video, by the way. <laughs> it's like so Andy Kaufman. I want you... I'm serious about this. I'm not kidding. I want you to post this all in one video. Alright. Alright? You promise? Yeah. Alright, uh... Since we're done now. No, let's do another one. I'm just kidding. Okay, here we go. How do I... Okay. <laughs> <laughs>
Oh man. <laughs> <laughs> Classy family look like a bunch of slobs. My guy's different. My family's no, different. Look, you're the same. Oh, it's right. that Adam's family guy, the weird <laughs> lady in the middle. High I'm school. so tired. I'd like different to me. <laughs> All right, if I win this game, we have to play five more games after this. Okay, and if yeah. you win, we can stop. If I win, we have to play ten more. <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm kidding. It's good that this game isn't, like, uh, Double Dare. Remember when we played that game, like, um, we didn't film it, but how many questions were repeats? Yeah. There was not a whole lot of replayability there. Well, maybe you just got unlucky with it. I don't know. Oh! Ideal age for U.S. President. Um. 16. This is hard, actually. Is there a minimum age for the president? I don't know. The youngest one was John F. Kennedy, right? I don't know. How he old was he? He was 35, I think. He was pretty no, young. that's too young, right? How old is Barack Obama? Wait, he must have been 40-something, right? Oh, was he? John F. Kennedy must have been, like, 45. He seemed young. Yeah, he must have been, like, 45. Barack Obama is, like, he's pretty young, too, but his hair's gone gray now. Yeah. Because the job is hard. That could happen when you're, you know, three. Wait. Whoa, that was a pretty three. good answer. Yeah, uh, evidently. It was the best one. It really was. You could steal this, but I'm going to do it. It's lime I time, viewers. also run the board. <clears throat> it's lime time, viewers. I think people would pick, like, multiples of five, you know what I mean? I completely agree with you. There's no way in hell 37 is on there. Or 57. Yes! It's just no way. This rules! Yeah, you should probably be able to do it now. 60? Yeah, of course. Wow. Would they get older than that, really? I mean, yeah. they do. It's it seems weird that you think that was ideal. I guess if you think you know, not you got to be wise. So, what was the uh, average uh, uh, lifespan for a human when this game was made? Too forty. <laughs> that matters. Forty. So I I don't know. I'm gonna say thirty five then. And they said that because of John F. Kennedy. Yes. <laughs> Good work. Oh, it's lying time. Yours is lying time. Live's in the game again. You're in the game. Live time. I got every one of them. It was hard. <laughs> Name something roof is made out of. I, I'm not going to come up with six different things. I know that. What? I said I'm not going to come up with six different things. I think roofs can be made of shingles. Definitely. If that's not number one, then... I don't even know what to say. Yes! Can you come up with five more things that a roof is made of? Uh, I'll try. I hope you don't steal it. Wood, maybe? I mean, it, it depends on what the, you know, roof of what. Right? Already answered. Wow, weird. It wasn't already answered. I guess shingles counts as what? Well. <laughs> brick. A brick roof, really. No. <laughs> the thing is, it says a hundred people were surveyed and this were their answers. There's no way that less than a hundred out of a hundred people said shingles, is there? Straw? I was gonna, that was the one I had in my head. I thought that was a... Wow. I thought I was going to be able to steal it with straw. How about iron? An iron roof. <laughs> Tar? Does that make sense? Not really. Well, yeah, actually. Yeah. It does. Of like a... 
corporate building? Yeah, yeah. Like apartment, maybe? Asphalt! Is cement asphalt? Probably. Okay. Uh... Oh, 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 oh. Glass room. Glass. Like a sunroom. No. Wow. It could be. Absolutely. How about like a tent? What's what a tent made out of? I don't know. Plastic? My answer though is metal. Oh, why did you win? Out of that at the time, I'm not so sure that I did. Metal. I know metal roofs Who definitely a metal exist. Roof? Lots of people. I don't know them. Because you don't need to replace them and stuff. They Are you like, yeah, yeah well, it's hot, you know, it's too hot. You don't have to stand on the roof. It'd be like in summer, you know. Slate, tile, tin, asbestos, <laughs> as this, asbestos. Have you never heard of asbestos before? Yeah, of course. It's like... Okay. It's dangerous because it's it a cancer. It can light fires. I think the cancer burns more dangerous. Oh fruck! I don't actually. I I panicked. I said I really fruck did. there. I didn't say anything else. I know that. Okay. Um. I have no idea. You know. Do you? Gargs. Golden retrievers, really? Sure. Where are you getting that from? Because it's like that, you know, just like... Are you trying to give me the game? Straight down the mid or middle dog. You, just, you split it down the middle? Like it's an average... Dog? It's like an average of all dogs. It's like a hot dog, right? That's a pretty popular dog. Hot dogs. <laughs> wow. Do you think hot is one of the answers? <laughs> Should be. I'm surprised no one likes golden. I I mean I don't know anything about dogs. Okay, so I don't either. If the same question was about cats, I still wouldn't know. I'd I like, love cat spewers. All cats are cats to me. They're great. I guess don't you know? Same. There's cats. There's like Persian cats. There's Siamese cats. Yeah, they all suck though. Are you kidding me? They're great. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm talking about right. cats. Come up with a dog. Bag. Was it my turn? Yeah. I think this is where I'll be on there probably. Poodle. This, this brings me back to that uh, double dare LP. Are you kidding me? I won. Poodles are the most popular. I don't think so. It's the stupid thing I've ever heard. What to do? What? To okay, do? so if you play it. And you you get them, then I can still steal if you don't get the whole board. Yes, but if you I do need it, to steal. You can steal. Correct. It's a tough one, isn't it? Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna let you do it. All right, I have a couple answers, and I still don't know how to spell Chihuahua. <laughs> yeah, I thought of that one. Now, lab is short for Labrador, right? Yeah, I guess. How do you spell it, though? I've definitely got some answers in my head. Do you know how to spell Labrador? It's like that, I think. It's got to be, right? Yeah. I wonder if I spelt it wrong or if people don't like Labradors. <laughs> Oh my god, okay, uh... Okay. How many chances do I get to steal this one? I don't know. You know? Yeah, just one. <laughs> yeah, you must know. Oh, that's, I was thinking that. That was one of my answers. I don't know if it's too specific or not. That was one I was thinking of, because people definitely like those, you know. I really have no idea. Maybe, uh... Does your mom own any dogs? No. Yeah. Is it a little weed? You spelled that wrong. 
But you got it anyway. Didn't care. Yeah, how, did, I, how I is he supposed to be spelled? You want to know what my, my dog my mom has is? Yeah, sure. She got a Shih Tzu. Yeah, I, was, I, would, I, I, I know about those, but I don't know. Yeah, you don't okay. spell it like that. Um. Yeah, that was a good answer. Uh, ah, crap. I finally knew what the dogs were called. I got one in my head. You could say, like, Big Dog. Clifford Dog. Oh, dude, I know. Me too. Clifford. Oh, I got one. You're out. No, I, I got another guess, don't I? Yeah. Alright, this one is for Elvis. <laughs> oh, right. I didn't think of that one. Yeah, that's right. Hound better be good enough. By the way, somebody requested that we do a... Uh, wow. That I try to get Elvis to do an LP with pants sometimes. So I've been talking to him about it, and he wants to do it. So, you know, look forward to that. Like, Hopefully we're going to get to do... We're gonna, we'll do an Elvis LP sometime. All right, now you need to come up with a single type of dog. Okay, uh, well, this is the one I was thinking about. What answer did I eventually get? I don't remember. Oh, German Shepherd. Oh, St. Bernard. Yeah, it's got to be there. Is this you win the game. What, I win the game? Yeah. Really? I mean, that's there. There you go. Two people guessed it. The way this gotta, game is played is really weird. We gotta see these other ones. Collie. Okay. Spaniel. Cocker. Del I was thinking of Dalmatians. Mm. Scotty. Cruella DeVille likes Dalmatians. That's right. I had the you, soundtrack of that one as a kid. You skunked me that game. Answer. Oh, well, it's line time, viewers. Name something you put in a hamburger. Well, I don't. I don't put Big on hamburgers because I don't. I don't like onions, but a lot of people do, though. Right? Yeah. Yeah. Maybe something found in a church. Pews. Right? Definitely. Maybe something you need a preservation for besides a sporting event. <laughs> Reservation. I remember that. I've seen that before. See what? Somewhere I've seen it. Maybe with another LP or this question? Yeah, that particular one. What is your best answer? Something made of rubber. I bet you a tire is. Think I'm right? Yeah, yeah it is. Maybe if something you put in coffee. Uh I was gonna say tea. <laughs> Do you want help with this one? Uh, There's really only two good answers. Spoon. No, are you kidding me? <laughs> Why? Do you try not to win? I don't even understand. Onion. Pew. Restaurant. Tire. Yeah. Spoon. Oh. So do you want some better answers? There? I could do it. Okay. Good luck. Answer five questions. Okay. Uh... <laughs> toe mate toe you don't put Tom on a hamburger uh um all tar all tar what the hell Are you <laughs> uh Con. That's a what? That's a terrible answer. What? Never mind. Concert. Where'd it go? Need something here, rubber. Uh. Oh, band. Yeah. Good answer. Are you making fun of me? No, that's you said you put in coffee. Oh, I know. Yeah, okay. Shoe. 
Milk or sugar? Take your pick. Shoot Not a spoon. God. <laughs> but you stir it with a spoon. Yeah, you misinterpret the. Oh, no tomatoes on hamburgers? All Yeah. Concert? No? Van? You're close. This is it. Shoot. There you go. You want it. Pickles would have been a good answer. Probably. I won the game. And like, I would have crossed for a church. Wait, okay, so <laughs> you won three games and I won three games. That's correct. Wow. Yeah. That means we have to do a tiebreaker. Does it? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> and then seven more after that. <laughs> Viewers, watch us play again. <laughs> <laughs> wouldn't it be funny if this didn't end and then you know when people watch the videos they thought it was going to end eventually but like and you look at the YouTube time you know when it has the time at the bottom of the video <laughs> yeah. but it, the time it says it says infinity <laughs> wow wouldn't that be something we should do an infinite live stream mm. that's what this is yeah, without the life part. <laughs> We're alive. We should just do the... Uh, it's fun to stay alive. We should Gino, do like, you sound like an outer space <laughs> commander. We should do it like uh, the Mexican runner, just like upload an eight-hour video. Yeah. And it's just us pointing this over and over again. Let's do it. <laughs> That's what I want to do. Well, this video is going to be as long as it is. Yeah. Take a guess at how long you think it's been. I don't know yet. Let's play. This is just... I win. Annoying. Why is that... Uh, these categories are dumb. No, I think, it, um... It's not dumb. Just because you're... You don't... You're a jock. Let's go with this. Hey, what... I have a question for you, Pants. I don't, I don't want to answer it. No, I'm serious. So I have a question. Yeah, I don't want it. I don't want it. Why not? Ask me some other time. What does lock and load mean? Like a gun? That's what my question is. What does lock and load mean? You lock and load your gun. So that, that means? I guess so. I mean, you load your gun. Well, I have a comic I mean, book called Lock and Load. See, because the, the characters' names, one is Mr. Lodowski and one is Mr. Lock or something, so they just call them Lock and Load when they become superheroes. You do something with... It's a humor comic, though. I don't really, you know... A ring. I won! Hey, a piece of jewelry people have been great. Why don't you like this one? This dumb category. I think it means basically like... I don't um, think so. Get ready, in the colloquial sense, is what it means. I'm going to let you do this one. Okay. Xenor. Now, are lockets and necklaces the same thing? What did you pick, Ring? Yeah. Are lockets and necklaces the same thing? Lockets on a necklace. Yeah. You win it. I have no idea. Waters? That's an answer. <laughs> no, silly. Watch. You won it. What the hell could be number one? You have a piece of jewelry people have engraved. Piece of jewelry. <laughs> the oh, I know. Obvious. I know what it is. Well, this seems like the You're same right. thing. It seems like crap. You press the wrong button. It seems like the same thing as a watch, kind of. That's what I no. Are you kidding? It's not even. It's not even close to the same thing. You can't I think tell a watch, time with, with a watch is just a bracelet that you can tell time with. No, you can't tell time with a bracelet. You're being ridiculous. No, but I didn't say you could. <laughs> you're, you're ridiculous. A watch is a bracelet. Yeah, too bad you, you tell time with. thought of that because I I thought of it too. Hey, did you look at the whole shoes? Look at them. Yeah. You passed that category to me and I got them all. Yeah, I, I just want you to know that. I'm a genius. Really? <laughs> I guess. 
Name a device used for cutting. I couldn't, like... I couldn't read. I'm gonna guess a knife would be one. I was just staring at that and no words, like, processed. A second? Yeah, that's hard to believe. It really is. Oh, that's what I was gonna say. That's the next answer. You, you, you say, probably got it again. You say that a lot. My second answers are usually the one I should give, I guess. I guess so. Oh, should I play or not? I guess so. I guess I should. Scissors. You win. Sardines? What? Are you kidding me? This is a word already. Saw. Yeah, I know what it is. <laughs> oh, okay. I've seen that word before. Um, laser? No. Totally is if you're a scientist. Yeah, I know. Um, cuts. Cuts, cuts, cuts. A device. Well, I wouldn't call it a device, but if you're trying to cut a person, this would work pretty well. Scapel? Oh, I, 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 uh, I just came up with some pretty good answers, I think. Cut. Would that count as a cut? Jeez. Scalpel, yeah, that's a decent answer. Okay, let's try... Let's try this. Oh! How do you spell this word? You did it. <laughs> okay. No. Okay, I had, I had another one. I think you can spell it both ways, but I'm not sure. What the hell did I have in my head? You're not allowed to pickaxe. I'm not gonna... Yeah. Pickaxe! There you go, pickaxe! That's not it. Oh man, I had an answer in my head. It was a really good one. Oh, I remember. I remember, yeah. Uh, okay, uh... Frick, what are those called? Oh my god, what are those called? Frick, what are those called? Oh my god. I I know I know an answer, but I can't. I don't know what they're called, and I would say it, but you you would. I don't want you to steal it. I'll what say it if you. Cutting. I know you're not gonna guess it, so I'll I'll come up with it afterwards. As long as I can think of what it's called. A device used for cutting. Oh, I got it. I remembered its name now. I think I got it for sure. Too late though. Cutting. Paper cutter. Don't actually take that. <laughs> yeah, it's like an axe. Hatchet? I was thinking that. I wonder if axe is on there. I'll let you pick axe if you want. It's too late. I think a machete is an answer. For sure. And maybe scythe. Oh. Razor. Okay. Lawnmower. Wow. Okay. Well, I wasn't thinking of cutting those things. That, that was a little bit obscure. You got to think outside of the box. I guess. Yeah, yeah. That box on the screen there. Yep. Let's see if I can read this time. Oh, man, I read it wrong. How is this a thing? A thing? Oh, my God. I thought it okay. said the best Samson of the year. I had to read it like 900 times to understand what it said. Because <laughs> I really can't read it. I should have so, it. I am, uh, what's it called? How, there's only four seasons. Yeah. <sighs> You're going to win. Okay. I'm going to try, but... Because, yeah, you, I know you can answer them. I know you know what the seasons are. <laughs> mm. What should I put in, autumn or fall? I'm going with autumn. It's a more romantic name. It's a better name for a child. Or, I mean, just a person in general. <laughs> Doesn't need to be a child. Uh, yeah, because Jennifer Love Hewitt's daughter is named Autumn. Is it? Yeah. How cute.
I knew a girl named Autumn once. She was hot, too. The thing is, this last one is obviously like a trick question, but there's so many answers that could be. I think you won. Do you think this is the answer? Christmas? Christmas season. Or are you just saying you can't come up with the answer? What's the other one? Didn't you Why? Do, did you do spring? I've got more time. Did you do spring? Dude, there's only four seasons. Do you know I spring? I put them all in. <laughs> I already answered the four seasons. I'm not an idiot. Yeah, Christmas, definitely. Maybe fall is the other answer. No. Wow. I was also thinking, like, for Americans, football, maybe. That sucks. Or something like that. Wow, you really won. Yeah, I, that was like the game the last time. You won by like, it was something like that. Yeah. <coughs> yeah. I'm sorry. Are you okay? Yeah. Do you want to lick a popsicle? Give me another. I did earlier. I had a popsicle earlier. I've got like a thousand words for cry. Since I do it all the time. You never cry. You said... Name I'm a woman's hobby. hobby. Cleaning. Knitting. Sewing. This uh, is a sexist category. Cooking. Uh, weeping. Imagine cleaning. Yeah, crying. No. Name a short hair uh, dog. Uh, this is BS, man. Uh, I don't terrier. Uh, shepherd? No, teppers. Terriers. Short why hair terrier. Why didn't you answer that before in the dog thing? I didn't think of it. Okay. Name something you see in newspapers, articles, words, print, oh. ads. Yeah, I know what ads. Uh, Classifieds, hookers. What? Name a what? state you really hear about. You never, <laughs> you rarely hear about. Vermont. This is it's just insulting if you ask me. Vermont. This. Yeah, I want Vermont again. No, but you hear about all the child rapists there. <laughs> I wonder if anyone from Wyoming is just... Yeah, I never hear about Wyoming. I, I forgot it existed, so... That was a good answer. Thanks. I forgot it existed. Cooking zero? Are you kidding me? That's not a hobby. It's something that women have to do. No, it is for some. <laughs> At least they used to have to do it, you know. They don't now. Another word for cry. Uh, uh, tears. Sob. Uh, or I almost said something really bad. Name a Name woman's hobby. hobby. Okay, like gardening or sewing. I'm going with sewing. That's a job too. They're all jobs. Um, how about how about nagging? <laughs> <laughs> Watching TV. There's the. I'm sorry. I'm things sorry. that are unisex. So I'm sorry, viewers. I'm sorry, all the female viewers. We lost all of them now. Yeah, you just lost. So I, I'm sorry. I apologize, female viewers, because I Name really, I, I don't want to lose you. I, yeah. I like you, and I, I was just joking. I was, I'm sorry. It was a bad joke. Yeah, that's the important thing. Come back, females. Right. He's just kidding. Yeah, if you're still listening after eight hours. <laughs> uh, something you see in the newspaper, eh? Any something you see in the newspaper. Every once in a while, news. Fish I got and one. chips. Let's try this. I was kidding, women. I was kidding. Okay. Don't know where to do it. They know. Okay. How about fish and chips? We don't have dumb viewers, remember? They're all you go geniuses. to Britain, fish and chips. Screw Britain. Name Just a state kidding. that you rarely hear about. How was Wyoming? How 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 much do you hear about Wyoming? Uh, what did it? What was it? What did Wyoming come up? I don't remember. But maybe if you like, do you know too much? If it's so much that they haven't heard of Dude, it. Dude, I hear about New Jersey you know. all the time. New Ham. Oh, New Hampshire? Sphere. New Hampshire, Wait, yeah. Aren't you coming back to New Hampshire, Molly? Wyoming wasn't there. Sewing worked. No. You see, it's so obscure that Yeah, they, they forgot about entirely. I wonder what would be there. I don't know. New Mexico? Can you hack into the game to find out? <laughs> I would like to. Is New Mexico a state? <laughs> Yeah. It's not in Mexico? No. Oh. Uh, let's see. What else is there? Maryland, maybe? No, that's your mom. <laughs> uh, 
uh, hmm, some sort of like Rhodesia, North, North Dakota, South Dakota, maybe uh, Rhodesia, Minnesota, Blackatolia, Washington. No, you hear about that? Yeah. The president of the uh, the country lives there. He doesn't actually. Yeah, you're right about that. He lives yeah. in uh, Washington D.C. Connecticut. Connecticut. Yeah, that's a good one. You know what a good state is? Massachusetts. Yeah, I was gonna say that. <laughs> and it's not just because of Johnny. Johnny's our friend, viewers. He's a friend we have. Is it because it's fun to say? Because they had good music taste in the early '60s. Like, there's some songs that I really liked, right? That did, I thought I thought they should have been huge hits, and some of them they didn't chart anywhere except in Massachusetts. Where? In it's Springfield, Massachusetts, to be specific. Is that where Dusty Springfield came from? No, she's British. Oh. Where Where is uh? You know it, did you? No. Where's Springfield? No. Where's Philadelphia? Pennsylvania. Yeah, that's right. Pennsylvania. North Carolina? I've heard of it. It's a pretty great one, if you ask me. I know that state. I bet just South Carolina is pretty great, too. Yeah. You know which one you hear about the most? California. Texas. New York. Is that a state? New York? Yeah, it is. Sometimes yeah. I think it's a city. Once upon a time, someone wrote a song about how it's kind of both. Yeah. It was... It's not very popular. I, most people have never heard of Dude, it. Dude, Frank Sinatra. Who the hell is that? He did it. Oh, yeah, right. Don't mention the other one. <sighs> That's who I was talking about. I don't I don't know there is another one. Yeah, don't mention it. Okay, I won't. Jackie Gleason? You miss him all in LBLPs now all the time. It's hilarious. I actually thought he was a musician for a second there. I Dude, he that. was. Oh. He led yeah. an orchestra, too. My mistake. Yeah, he had an orchestra. I bet you didn't know that. I had no idea. It's just funny you said that. Hey, so, um, I don't know. That's it, right? Are we live? Oh, yeah, we're live. Whatever that means. You know what we should do as a bonus for the viewers? What's that? You should load up another game. that you, It's like an Easter egg. Like Nobody will see it except people who have stayed this long. Let's just pretend we didn't. But we didn't. Well, the thing is I actually can't do it because I just... Uh, I stopped the video recording. The audio is still going though. Oh, I was going to say you should load up something like Bubble Bath Babes or something like that. Because it's like, it's a, it's like a Tetris game with Bubble Bath Babes. But then we would have to have a... Um, you know, a, a viewer warning on our thing and like yeah, but you'd it's have to sign end. in. It's at the end, so people won't notice. You'd have to sign in to view it. Yeah, but people won't notice. Now that's rude. Maybe I don't know. Except for Beat Chef. If you want to see that, just use Google. You know. If anybody's still here besides Beat Chef or Bing, whichever you prefer. Actually, Beat Chef, tell us if you're still here. We know that you are, but <laughs> just to make sure. Make a comment and say that you're still here, okay? Yeah, there And everybody else that's still here, make a comment and tell us you're still here. Oh, hey, you know what? We can use this opportunity for me to tell Beat Chef that uh, when I laughed that time, it was because of the way that line said whatever he said. Well, explain right? to what you're saying. You might not know what you're, you're talking about. Oh, he knows what I'm talking about. When I sniggered. I've never heard that word before. I, I have. Yeah, well, you hear more words than I do, I guess. Yeah. Yeah. But, uh, yeah. So, Beat Chef, you know how in Britain uh, you have different words for things? The, the loo. Yeah, the yeah, the loo. The and brawly. The lolly? The brawly. What's the brawly umbrella? Yeah. Yeah. And, uh, like, Chloe was talking about a bunch of those. We were talking in a, in a Skype chat with her, and she was talking about a bunch of those. And, yeah. and of course, an the elevator's a lift. The basement, I think, is their garage. 
Yeah, something like that. Well, I, I, cause I don't think they have basements or. What's a know. transom? Or at least not much of them. Transom? I have no idea. I think that's a British thing. Hey, beach. Is that a British a transom? Is British word for half, ha- half and half? No. I, it might be like I think a transom might be a baby carriage, but I'm not sure. Hmm. Tell us, tell us what it is. Uh, 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 what's his name? Beach Jeff. <laughs> they love the word. Uh, uh, not. Yeah. Said zero. Oh yeah, yeah. That's a pretty interesting one. Not. Yeah. So you know what they call X's and O's when they play X's and O's, right? Yeah, knots and crosses. Yeah, you know about that. Yeah. And George Formby had a song called that. You remember that one, Beat Chef? Because <laughs> he he used to listen to George Formby when he was a kid all the time. You know. George Foreman was a singer. No, George Formby. Oh. Famous British singer. I did one of I, his songs. I did When I'm Cleaning, like, recent. That's my recent, recent song. I'd like to hear a George Foreman song. No, no. Yeah, it'd be great. It's different. And he would just, like, be punching his face or something? Well, dude, I've got two... I've got a song by Muhammad Ali on a CD. Oh, that's pretty cool. Yeah, he sings Stand By Me, you know, the Benny King song? Hey, well, I... Yeah. The thing about George Foreman is, I mean... He doesn't do it too badly, either. Well, he's... Because he's the champ. I he guess. was Cassius Clay when he did it, though. What else is there? There's definitely some other weird... Oh, yeah, person. yeah. Tell us some more, Beach F. Well, they Which call I guess aren't all that weird, they, right? they call policemen bobbies. I don't think that's what they call them. I think that's, like, a Mountie. A Nick with the Nick British Nick. version. No, no, no. It's policemen. Really? Yeah, because it was named after the first, like, the, the first guy that was a policeman or the first police commissioner, Bob something, or... Oh. That's what Chloe said, I think. In America, we call them pigs. No, and I don't know why I said... Now, that's terrible. You I don't know that. why I said we, since take I don't that live in back. America. Why? Well, Apologize for that. I, I don't do it. In Canada, we call them policemen or cops. Now, they do that in the States, too. OPP. That's only in Ontario. They uh, the they they play uh, piano too. I was just kidding about the police joke. I don't know. I'm not. They you know I'm kidding. Right. The police play the piano. Yeah. By mm-hmm. the way, all the police here in Canada, they all like they all. You mean have, like Sting? They all, Every breath you take. That's not how the song goes at all. They uh the uh the police here. Uh, they all ride horses and they dress in red and have hats. Sir, they're all Mounties here. All the policemen in Canada. Why are you doing that? Well, that's what they think, right? Yeah. Don't perpetuate that. <laughs> it's cool, though. I like that. I I'd like that if that was the case. I think it's cool. We also don't. <laughs> we also don't have cellars because we just live in them. I think. I but we call that. them igloos. Yeah, I heard igloos, but not cellars. Well, that's what I mean. We don't need cellars. Cause and it goes like this. It goes, Hardly ever thank the stars above For sending me your very precious love I hardly ever say a prayer Or thanks to someone way up there Who gave me such a lucky break Oh no, darling Only with every little breath I take that's how it goes. Oh, I see. <laughs> by the way, that's where they got the name of the song. They were inspired by that song. Uh, what makes you say that? I've read it, I think. Yeah. And I didn't do that. There's a lot well, of false actually, things available. To viewers, me. I didn't do that very well right now. So if you want to hear me sing well my song, my actual song videos, you know. You could be right about that. But... And who did that song? Who 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 had to hit with that? Every breath I take. The Supremes. It's a joke, obviously. It was Gene Pitney. In the Cowboys. No, just Gene Pitney. You know a great oh. Gene Pitney. Oh, yeah. I, I kind of prefer my peaches without them, though. So for everybody that's still here right now, Pants is going to do something really special for you. I, I wish I wasn't. He's perfected a uh, virtual reality simulator. Oh, yeah. And he's going to give you a massage. Jump into my world. Give him a massage, Pants. 
That doesn't sound like a massage. Okay, I, I loved it. I'm sorry. Alright. I feel bad now. This is the end. Well, you're mad now. No, this is a good movie, though. What was a good movie? Yeah. You wouldn't like it. What are you talking about? You wouldn't like it. I don't know what he's talking about, viewers. Alright, so, uh... Maybe there's a movie called Massage or something. <laughs> no. Um... Okay, I have a question, Pants. Do you think... Do you think in massage parlors... They actually, they all just, they give, mas well, I know some of them give more than massages, obviously, right? <clears throat> yes. Do, think, do they all do that? No, of course not. So some of them are just massages. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I thought. What a ridiculous question. What do you think question. the percentage is? Uh, I don't really know. I don't think it needs to be all that. The other places don't need to do it, because if you want that, you'll just go to an, you know, what they do, don't they? The other ones? Yeah, I mean, there's, I don't think there's enough of a demand for... I don't know. I don't think men get massages very often either. I could be wrong. I feel like it's predominantly woman activity. Dude, but men like to have massages. Maybe that was the top answer for that game. Hobbies is getting massages. No, dude, it's always like men going to massages like in... Uh... You know, some movies and TV shows. <laughs> okay. It's a very well-crafted point you make. Thanks. Let's, uh, let's be moving on out now. All right, well, every It's time work? for us to put Cheerios in our mouth. This is the part in the, uh, the LP where Pants gives you a, uh, a, a little bedtime story to go to sleep. Do it, Pants. Once upon a time, there was a wolf. He cried, boy. The boy punched him in the head, and he never came back. Problem is, your stories are violent. Let me tell them a story. Well, that one was, you know, triumphant, though. Here's a bit. Okay, once story upon a be... time, there was a goose. And she was a mother of a thousand children who lived in a boot. And one day... The mother was like, there's too many children in this boot for one goose to, to care for. So she uh, picked them up and put them in clouds, and that's where they live for the rest of their life. You realize that people could, if they really are big fans of us, they could put this on when they go to bed, and it would just like keep them company all night? It's an interesting <laughs> thing to say, but... Uh, <laughs> Uh, you know. Once upon a time. All right, stop doing. I have yeah. a story. Okay, make it uh, relatively quick. Okay. And then say the thing that you say. The cat who lost his nose. Darn it! I actually want to tell that story, but I don't. Uh, I don't have it on me right. Just now. do it next time. Yeah, I should tell that story sometimes. It's pretty yeah. funny. Yeah, it's probably great. Short, too. Okay. Once upon a time, there were elves that lived in a tree. And, Let's uh, call them nymphs instead. And uh, so this, this, these two people, these two people, they went, they were on a date. Yeah. Uh, in the, the park? Let's call them cat and lime. And they went to the forest on their date. <laughs> because I like to walk in forests. And Cat wants to come too. By the way, a lesson. If you're a female and someone wants to take you on a date into a forest, don't do it. Unless you're, they're me, then it's okay. Sure. Because I, I have taken girls in the forest and I, I didn't do anything bad. <laughs> That's noble of you. On dates, I have. And other times. Okay. <laughs> Not bad. Okay, anyway, we're in the forest. And, uh... We say, we watch, hey, what's that? What's that sound? And we go look, you know. 
And uh, it's like these, say, what's this coming from that tree over there? Buffalo it's, Springfield? What's that in the tree? And then we go to a tree, and guess what? It's elves. Elves living in a tree. No, it's nymphs. And then the elves say, What? You found us. We live in this tree. And we said, What are you doing in there, you know? And that's how other people not found you. And so because usually we make ourselves invisible, you know, but we uh, we, we didn't this time because we didn't hear you coming. We hear you coming. You're really quiet. I said, wow. <laughs> and, and then I said, well, what are you doing in the tree? And they said, we make furniture and ship it out to discount stores. <laughs> and... Uh, so they're Amish? <laughs> what? They're Amish elves. I don't know what you're talking about. And then we make cookies. And and they make cartoons of us and call us the Keebler elves. So I said, that's great. And I said, well, we're going to be on our way now, okay? And then the elves say, okay. Don't tell anybody we're here, all right? Because we don't want them to chop our tree down. <laughs> or put up a condominium. <laughs> so they said, okay. We won't. We said. <clears throat> so next, we go farther into the forest, and we hear this, this weird sound like, yeah, 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 yeah. And we're like, what is that? <laughs> and so we say, what, is somebody lifting weights? And we go to this guy and we said, What are you doing? Who are you? He says, I'm Tank Man. He's Tank Man. And I said, Why are you called Tank Man? He says, Because I'm built like a tank. And I said, Oh, we can see that. You look like a tank. And what are you doing in the forest? I'm lifting weights. I'm doing my workout. And we say, Oh, okay. Why you do it at a gym or something, you know? Why you do it in the forest, right? Because I like to commune with nature when I do it. Oh, okay. Well, you just keep doing it, okay? Hey, you're pretty hot. You know, it's my girlfriend, Kat. You can't do anything. Go. <laughs> you get out of here before I punch you in the face. You know, what are you doing with a weak man like that? I'm going to kick sand in your face. Well, you can't because there's no sand here. Oh, okay. So anyway, so then that's it. I'm getting out of the scope hat. And then we run, we run, because it's, you know, get away, get, get away from the tank guy. And then after we run, I'm like, that was pretty hot. Let's run again. <laughs> okay, anyway, back to the story. Back to the story. All right. We come upon a lake. It's unbelievable, right? It's this lake in the forest. And I'm like, this is so beautiful. You know, this lake and the water is clear blue. It's like, it's like in Toronto or something. You know? <laughs> Wait, come on, I got a good story here. So, okay. What, okay, okay, okay. So we say, how are you going to get across this lake? This is what we say, viewers. How are you going to get across the lake? right and the thing is that we said there's no bridge right so what are we gonna do so all of a sudden this this ogre shows up and he's like if you answer three riddles three questions i'll let you cross the lake okay wow. what a bizarre ogre and and they always do this you kidding trolls maybe yeah and so this ogre says number one who won the first World Series? <clears throat> Do you know the answer, Pants? No, it's probably a team that doesn't exist anymore. <clears throat> and so we say... <clears throat> um, the Green Bay... No. Uh, <laughs> we say... Uh, New York Yankees. The, we say the uh, New York Yankees, right? And then he said, okay, the second one. You got that question wrong, by the way. Wait, 
away. He hadn't said it yet. Oh, okay. You give him, don't give his story away. I'm sorry. Okay. <clears throat> I actually don't know if you did. I don't know the answer. What does P2P stand for when you play games? God. And we say peer to peer, right? And then he said, last question. It's a weird troll. Or, okay. He oh, says, P2P. What? <laughs> You got it. He eats pea soup, did you say? No. These aren't riddles, by the way. These are just trivia questions. <laughs> keep going. <laughs> the ogre says, the cat says, what's your bra size? Oh, my God. Why is this happening? And I say, okay. And she says, that's enough. Okay, I'm not going to answer that question. And I said, yeah, she shouldn't have to answer that, you know. I'm going to stand up for her. She's not going to answer that. I mean, people ask her that all the time, you know. And it's like on the Internet, it's one of the most popular questions. But she's not going to answer that. And you should be more respectful than to say something like that. So we would not accept your question. <laughs> so you've got to ask another question or I'm going to punch you in the face. And Tank Man, I'll get Tank Man to do it because he's a tank. He's built like a tank. And so he says, okay, the ogre says, okay, okay, let me do one more. Let you give me another chance. And so we say, he says, what's my name? Right? And I said, wait, come on, you stole it like from Rumpelstiltskin or something, right? This is like, you ripped it off. And he says, okay, I can do another one. <laughs> All right, he says... What is the most common screen resolution <laughs> and number of pixels on a common monitor? <laughs> and so we say um, 1,240 by uh, 800. Yeah. And then the pixels, we say, it's a lot of them, you know, two, 2,485, 87, sorry. Time out. You think that 1,240 times 800 is 2,000? Sure. Okay. <laughs> if you change the 8 to about a 2, you're kind of close, but sure. The troll says, you're right. You got all the answers right. <laughs> all you get to cross the river. This is just a dumbass ogre. And then I'll say, okay, let's do it. He goes, well, I'm going to have to, like, contact the building commission because, like, you know, I don't have a bridge or anything. You have to, they'll have to bridge it or something, you know? <laughs> I said, well, how long is that going to take? He said, well, it might take, like, a, a few months or so, if you don't mind waiting. I'm like, oh, this is ridiculous. This is ridiculous. We'd all up for nothing, you know? But then all of a sudden, this rhinoceros shows up. <laughs> right? <laughs> and he comes up from the water. <laughs> and he says, Hi, I'm Mr. Rhinoceros. And I said, Wow. He says, I'll help you get across the water. And we're like, Okay, thanks so much. And he said, Wait, but first... You gotta guess what my hobby is. And they say juggling. <laughs> right? And he says, that's right. I like to juggle bouncy balls. And then he, he, he demonstrates like how good he is at juggling, you know. So I say, that's great. And he says, now get on my back and I'll take you across the river lake. Street. So we do. And he does. Please tell me the end of the story is a hole on the other side. No, and then at the other end of it, there's like... It's happily ever after. There's like a... a um, there's a pot of gold. Yeah, there's a pot of gold at the other end. Mm. And then a leprechaun shows up, right? And he says... Naturally. Get, you, get you, your hands off of me gold! It is me gold. Uh, I got to have it. It is, it is mine. Yee. I'm going to hit you with my shillelagh. That's what he says, right? 
With his what? With my shillelagh. Never heard of such a thing. Shillelagh is like an Irish, like, walking stick type thing. Mm, okay. Right? Sure. And, and we say, just hold on a second. Are you telling us that with an accent like that, you're actually Irish? <laughs> you're faking it. He goes, oh, you're right, I am faking it. He says, oh, I'm so ashamed. He said, I'm actually, my name is actually Beat Chef. And I watch your videos that you do with Cat, but she's not in them, though. It's a guy named Pants. And I say, okay, well, if you don't tell it, then I'll let you have the gold. And you could be on your way. And I said, well, you won't tell. It's fine, you know. So we take the gold and say, oh, we're all happy. And then we leave it, and then we live happily ever after. Everything's all good. And we get married, of course. That's rude. You should give the gold back to Beach Chef. You just stole it from him. Well, he's not really Irish. You're immoral. He's not a leprechaun. You're, you're, you're a thief. That's what I got out of this story. He's just not, he's not a leprechaun, you know? It's just ridiculous. <laughs> if anyone else is still listening at this point, seriously, write a comment in the thing below. Anyone else. And Beach Chef, if you're still listening... Make a comment about how you you're, you pretend you're a leprechaun. <laughs> All right? <laughs> All right, good stuff. And, okay, so I hope everybody enjoyed the video, the family feud, and the bedtime stories, and the talking. And so, uh, you got anything else to say? What, what do you like to sign off with? What do you like to tell the viewers, Pants? Plug your nose when you're going to sneeze. Well, don't, like, put plugs in it or anything. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Yeah, don't do that, no. No, do it. <laughs> All okay. Right. And remember, viewers, it's fun to stay alive. <laughs> oh, this is going to be a great video. <laughs>